depression, addiction, mental health, anxiety, depression, you name it, we, co- we cover a full... It's close word. enough, I'm fucking idiot. It's a word it's used. We cover a full... I'll remember. I'm sure we did out the problem, people losing that page. He's... Yeah, I believe that as well. All oh, happened for a reason. What a liar. I'll play this at the start of the live just so it's easy to find. Um, just so it's easy. Teams of people selling gear for me, including my mum, believe it or not. I'd given her one of my regular. What was that, Jim? Selling gear for me, including my mum, believe it or not. I'd given her one of my regular clients from my youth who would buy a few bags of wizard every day. Teams of people selling gear for me, including my mum, believe it or not. I'd... Teams of people selling gear for me, including my mum, believe it or not. I'd given her one of my regular clients. Teams of people selling gear for me, including my mum, believe it or not. I'd given her one of my regular clients from my youth who would buy a few bags of whiz every day. Teams of people selling gear for me, including what my mum, believe it or not. Just... In case you're not with the first second for the fourth and fifth times, you would buy a few bags of whiz every day. Teams of people selling gear for me, including my mum, believe it or not. What was that, Jim? Sorry. One of my regular clients from my youth who would buy a few bags of whiz every day. Let me one more time for posterity. Teams of people selling gear for me, including my mum, believe it or not. Inciting violence and trying to make out. I have made it perfectly clear on numerous lives that I am nothing to do with the paramilitaries. Never have been, never will be. But yeah, I I'm going to report him to the police. He's trying to. He's definitely stopped over the line now. He's broke a few laws of that live. I hope somebody's got it. Yeah, I can't wait. These steps fought back in the UK. I just can't wait. He's definitely he's fucked. I'm not going to have him talking about me like that. There, he's a scumbag. <laughs> Just because he's a scum of the earth. He likes to think that everyone else is on the same page as him. What are you doing lying down here? Mind. Yeah, but anyway. He's drunk now. He just, he can't help himself. He's going to get himself in an awful lot of trouble. Yeah, no, he's live again. I was watching him there. He's, he's just, he's broke a serious amount of laws there. Never mind uh, Facebook. <clears throat> I am going to, I'm going to contact my solicitor here on Monday morning and see what can be done about it. Because uh, I'm sure people have the lives and, well, yeah, he's, he's trying to say that I'm in the paramilitary. He's trying to rally, rally people up from Northern Ireland to go against them. He's trying to say that I sent that woman to take that picture. Every single thing he's saying is tell, he's lying. He's telling lies. It's a lot out. He has, he's trying to get me. He's trying to get me in the shit. And people over here have seen the paramilitaries, see if they get wind that he's been throwing their names about. They won't like it at all. They'll fucking skin them. Oh, shut me back. Of course it's lies, but they're, they're blatantly obvious now. Everything he's saying, everybody, everybody's just been around that long. And everybody actually knows the full story about what happened. Then they're just they're just laughing at him now. And people are going, oh my god, he is just he's a shit star. But just for those of you that have only joined, um, you might not have heard us here before, uh, but teams of people selling gear for me, including my mum, believe it or not. I'd given it one of my regular clients from my youth who would buy a few bags of whiz every day. Teams of people selling gear for me, including my mum, believe it or not. 
I'd given her one of my regular clients from my youth who would buy a few bags of whiz every day. Teams of people selling gear for me, including my mum. There you go. But we're telling lies. I'm telling lies. It's just as poor. It's as poor. Uh, it's as poor innocent man. There's nothing fucking innocent about any one of them. Nothing innocent about any one. Yeah. Yeah. Does anybody want the link to come on? Inbox me if you want the link. Sorry, I was busy earlier there. I'm not can't find the scissors. So I'm back here. All right. Where they sat down. Fucking the sitting eight nice pop here and there's about a thousand cat please lying beside me. Yeah, inbox me if you want to come on. I'm trying to find the scissors here, but I can't. Oh, there they are. They're on the wrong top of that. Anybody rob a bank for me and buy me a pair of silly socks? <laughs> oh, Kirsty Thompson, that's hilarious. Yeah, they are pretty expensive when you can get five or six pairs of socks in Primark for a fiver. Why would anybody want? Yeah, he called the he called me an Irish bastard, and uh, he called. Irish people cunts in a phone call and he called me an Irish bastard on a voice message. Now he's looking up, looking the nose. Or anybody in Belfast? Anybody in Belfast? And he's trying to say that his mum's innocent and that... Oh, fuck off, Davenport. Nothing to do with you, he's innocent. I have loads of stuff on Maxine's family too, so don't even try and go down that road. None of us are as squeaky clean as you're portraying. You and your wee bum buddies. Fucking running about Facebook, trying to lie and trying to report for you. They're as bad as you are, and they should all give their heads a wobble. Yeah, yeah, Mr. D is related to every Irish person in the, in the world now. And they're all asking questions about me. That's not how it works, little D. Especially not with people in Cyprus. People like that don't do things over social media or electronic communications. Stuff like that's done face-to-face. -face. You're an idiot. Five pairs of plain black socks, two quid in Primark. Yeah. There's nothing decent about that man at all. Or anyone to do with him. Let me see. Let's see, does George Deans want the link? Somebody come on and talk to me. Fucking case. Oh, George, man. Well, George, um, how got ice popped in my mouth? He's trying to say now that he never said that his mum's of sold drugs. I heard him saying that earlier. You missed the start of the live, mate. This one. Oh, where did that fucking phone go? How'd I get over there? Me fucking rookin'. Right. You look clients from my youth. You would buy a few bags right. of Right, what's this? 
Teams of people selling gear for me, including my mum, believe it or not. I'd given her one of my regular clients from my youth who would buy a few bags of whiz every day. Teams of people selling gear for me, including my mum, believe it. So, who's lying yeah. now? And Yeah, always. Telling lies about me. He tried to say that um, I said I was in the power militaries. <laughs> He's a fucking idiot. No, but even if you were, you wouldn't be stupid enough to make out them sort of threats on Facebook. What sort of a fucking yeah. moron is he? They don't like people running about trying to cause trouble like that there too, firing their names about. He mentioned the IRM, me a prod mate. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> I was just I was just waiting for that one like I was waiting for it you know fine rightly it was coming didn't you yeah and he's trying to say that that bit where I said uh, um, I, re I read it I was actually had to read it off Google the line from Taken and he's trying to say that there's a death threat what an idiot Anything for attention. Somebody said to say. Mm. He's been telling he's been rushing the his followers over here. There was a load of stuff got reported earlier over here. They got one one hat. But I don't care, because thousands of people have already seen it. George has dropped off. <laughs> Which bit are you laughing at, Kim? He tried to say that I said I was in the IRA and me a Protestant. And I've stated that I was a Protestant from the very start on lives. What an idiot. He obviously hasn't done his homework before he starts spouting, spouting his bullshit. Ashton, you're more than welcome to come on. Let me get the link here sent. I'll get one of the admins to post the link here. Admins, I'm posting in chat. Can one of you uh, give that there to Ashton? Nobody's looked at it yet. I don't know. It's coming out. Ah. Ah. Hi, Johnny. Hi, Gary. How you doing? There you go, Ashton. That's the link there. He can't go about saying them sort of things. That there is... That there is inciting violence. <laughs> well, he shouldn't be mentioning their names because that there sort of shit gets you in trouble. People from over here know that there, but he's from Salford, like... Not exactly the brightest fucking bulb in the box. Hi, Linda. He was. I don't know where he's still alive or not. No problem, Ashton. The links are anyway. George is on a phone call. Has he just ended up? He can't keep going around saying things like that about people that aren't true. He's going to end up in an awful lot of trouble. I have I have a sneaky feeling he's broke about 20 or 30 laws that are not live. And just because he deletes it, we get them all. We record them as to go along. I don't know. He tells, he makes, makes things up. He makes things up as he goes along. That's that's his narcissistic side telling people that.
what he's doing. And he gets kicked. The people believe him. There's people following that man's every word. And they're mostly lies. He always eat. He's always someone over here spying. I don't care. Like, you can report me to the cows come home. You're not going to get me. I'll still be here, and I'll still be going live, and I'll still be contradicting that man. He does gaslight them. Not there was gaslighting what they were talking. We were talking about it earlier. That woman with a hundred pound to pay for members of the tribe. For, to pay for 10 people, that there came out of his pocket. He's so fucking sneaky. He's so sneaky. Whitney, Whitney loves loads of things for breakfast. She's a sex addict, so she says anyway. Then she wouldn't have a problem going fucking herself. Yes, there we go, right? I said, "We see what he said there." His insurance policy. I make it up as I go along. Carry you make nice pops. It's um, all I can eat some days, and my stomach's giving me brother. Jack, the way it worked out there was it wasn't that he's gave that he's got that woman to come on saying she's given a hundred pounds for ten people. I can't I can't see any him he's a I hear him. But did he actually take money off someone, or was that a setup? I have more of a feeling that, that there was a setup where he was taking the money off them people. And, well, he wasn't taking the money. He was saying that there was a hundred pound. Then he'll pay for their first month. And then that it just basically means he's gave them a month free and then he gets them hooked in so he takes more and more money off them. It's a fucking scam. It's a scam. Oh, I hear him with a passion. No, he's ignoring Lorna at the moment. It's, it's all about Shinny. I'd love to know if he has broken any laws or is anybody is anybody tuned in as to if he's broken any laws? Uh, the page inbox isn't working um, for some reason. I tried it earlier. Well, somebody messaged on it. I couldn't get on that. Oh, no, it's working fine. I couldn't get on on the other phone. Hmm. There you go. People letting us know what 
at Cheney, people are letting us know there. We get messages to the inbox of the page there telling us about what he's at, what he's trying to do. It's a great place of information. It is all on your YouTube. He's horrible, Lorraine. I don't know why he's getting away with this here. He can't keep getting on with this here and expect, expect a good outcome. He should have learned the last time. Yeah, he's trying to word it differently, but there's bound to be legal repercussions to what he's doing. <laughs> oh, God, Tracy. <laughs> Would somebody come on and talk to me here? I want to hear what anybody else has to say, what he's saying. I want to know what someone else thinks of his last life here. Yeah, Joel, I think I will report it to the police. Has anybody got that last live? Did anybody manage to save it? Or is it still up? But that there was going a bit too far. And even at that, I'll contact the Cypriot authorities as well. And Interpol. If I can remember correctly, when he was getting pulled out, pulled up on saying Irish twats, he turned around to Maxine and he said, You're you're Irish, aren't you, Maxine? She goes, Yeah, far back. And then he goes, Oh, our baby's gonna have Irish blood. That was when he was called out on. That's when he was called out on saying about Irish cunt and Irish twat. Yeah, it's absolutely disgusting. All I've done, all I basically done, was put a picture of his mum's head on a paper army. But he's going too far. <laughs> he should have left my name out of his mouth. I wasn't well. And I won't put up for bullshit, especially not over him. Esther, he was live again. On the Shinny's page. Everybody says the error of your ways. The error of your ways is a well-known saying. You'll learn by the error of your ways. Terrorism and inciting violence reported twice. He thinks that he's going to get away with stuff like that there. I have friends that are connected to that sort of malarkey, so I'll talk to them. I'll show them his life, and they can discuss what they want to do. But I ain't taking no part of the threats like that there. He should be worried now. Is that last live up on Shinny's page? On or is the new kitten just deciding to come out of her wee hiding place? I 
uh, I couldn't uh, do her litter tray up for her. I just couldn't leave her. In... I got an hour kitten to keep monkey company and he fucking growls at her. He sits and growls at her constantly. Tracy, I've just been... Oh, sorry, I was looking at the cat there. I'll try and look back. Yeah, that's the one, him sitting there drinking with Maxine. Was he actually drinking or Maxine? I bet you there was alcohol in that glass. He's he's such a liar. He's not in recovery. He knows that it's horrible. <laughs> it was on the Shinny's page. It was the very last live on Shinny's own page. Let me see. I'll get the other phone here. I'll try and find it. I'm going to wait and take for our eyes pop. I'd give it to one of my regular clients from my youth. He would buy a few bags. I used to be able to say that there. If he says that part of his book is lies, do some download it, please. As I need a copy of it, it's just I'm live on this phone here, and it's the only one a Facebook downloader on. But if he turns around and says that part of his book is lies about his mother selling his drugs, what other part of his book is the truth? What parts of his book is the truth? No, it's all right. I know where it is. I just, I need the actual live downloaded if I'm going to show it to the police. But it's my whole family have been in the place since I was a kid, so I'll take it to them and see what the step is to take. <coughs> yeah, he's such a, he's a compulsive liar. Does anybody want to come on here? Hello. She's got such a... Would it, did you hear her meow there? It's such a weird... It's such a funny meow. Let me hear you. What did you say? She's sitting there purring. Any money she's after food. Yeah. She's after food. She doesn't want to come out of her wee cave. No, it's not food. She's up for getting out of her wee cave for a second. He does delete his threatening lives. He does delete them. That's why I was asking, has anybody got it? This is what our page is also about. I can't stand them. Oh, somebody's got them. It's okay. I will take a copy of that there. Because, um, it's okay. We've got it. Yeah, he's bringing Maxine into them. Like, he's going to end up having that girl. Somebody is going to meme her. Somebody is going to meme that girl, and she's not going to be happy with the shit she gets. Is she going to think? If I was her, I'd be double thinking. I'd be thinking, what am I doing with this man, full stop? Is this really where I want my life to go? As he's not exactly good in any shape or form. She maybe wants to go back to her ex, if he'd take her. But that man's going to bring nothing but heartache and trouble into her life.
it will be taking an effect in her business. People, he's going to drag her in that, and people are going to start working against her and her business, and she's going to end up with nothing. And well, we'll just say what will you. Told you so, Maxine. Shouldn't be my mama got there. Uh, she doesn't want to listen. She's obviously, I'm sure she's hurt us all. It's like a woman stand with a rapist. And we know that there is possibly true. Well, it could be exactly the case. It would be the same as her stand with a rapist. Because, well, he did say he manipulated 2,000 women into bed, and that equates to nothing more than rape. Manipulation means that if you manipulate the woman, that means she didn't want to do it. If a woman doesn't want to do it, there's a word for that. It's called rape. Sorry to say, but it's true. You're right, Nicky. It's just it's the same, same, same. He done the same thing with Lee as he's doing with me now. Trying to get people to go to my house. And he's going to get someone injured, but I'm no, I'm no pussycat. Like, he's took them down. He's took them down. He's yellow. He's a card. He knows he's broke the TOS, but well, I've got them now, so I'll take them to the police. And I'll take them to. I'll take him to Interpol. I'm going to have to look up now after I get off his live how to contact in Interpol. Fur, <laughs> nice one. Sam, I love your sense. You're a funny fucker. <laughs> you not break me, do I'm about as concerned about him as I am the fucking mouse. Lorraine, if he comes to my house, I'd just pick up the phone. By the time I was off the phone, any access to the state would be blocked off. I'd probably, as soon as they asked someone where I live, I'd get a phone call. I know for a fact I would. Yeah, I'll be going to enter, Paul. The whole life, the whole lot, and I was saying that I feel my life's in danger because of this dangerous uh, con man on the internet, but we tried to expose him for taking money from vulnerable people. And we'll find out who uh, Charmin, uh, we'll find out who seen someone post earlier there that the person Kyle Sheaton posting all the remarks is also one of the ones behind, um, what's the name of their page? Lorraine, what's the name of that page? PG was friends with them. They tried annoying me for a long time. Bonnie. No, not the real raw truth. It's the other one. Oh, 
what do you call it? Oh, I can't mind the name of it. Fuck, it's how long ago. It, uh, that's how interested I am in them people. That's how interested I am in anything they have to say. I can't remember the name of their page. No, not that one, Carrie. It's another one. No, Vigilante Exposure belongs to William Hassels. Um, uh, we thought it was uh, Mark Chapman at one stage. No. Yeah, Kyle Sheaton is bunny. It's uh, Charmin Carl. That's who it is, telling all them lies about me on that page. So I'll be going to the place about that there as well. Horrible bastards. But hey, it all comes out what sort of people they are, we know they are. No, Carrie, it's not that there. It's one of the wee smaller pages. Kyle, Charmin, Carl, yeah. I can't remember the name of their page. That's going to annoy me. Equalizer plus one. Equalizer plus one. It is Equalizer plus one is uh, Kyle Sheaton that's posting all them comments in Shenny's live. Horrible bastards. Uh, anyway. I don't really care. I have more accounts than you can shake a stick out. Oh, there's gangstar granddads for hire. I know who that is. <laughs> Hi, Gangstar. Why is nobody jumping on here? I'm just sitting talking shit these anyway. Chapman is way up Shinny's ass, sure. We had, we had a whole argument with Chapman um, one other night. We were live on YouTube. And Chapman was in the comments giving it 90. All of him. Mark, Mark Chapman, the writer. The writer, only write. I write, I like that one. Uh, anyhow, not bothered by any of them. I'm going to have to, Kim. It'll get him arrested in Cyprus because that their kind of behavior is dangerous. But you can't go around especially with the volatile political situation in Northern Ireland. You can't be running around saying that there sort of thing or carrying out them threats. If I was someone lesser than what I am, I would actually be worried, but I know better. But threats that I got there could get a wee wannabe to come around to my door and try something, and they're going to get hurt. Anybody comes around to my house is obviously going to get hurt because I have all sorts of blades. Yeah, sure. Did you hear Shinny saying he was coming to Ireland himself? Shinny said he's coming to Ireland. Yeah, he wants to knock my back doors on. I don't know. I need to find the messages again. I really need to go back in them. I was shown at the time, but I talked to that many people on here. You know that yourself. That it just... Uh, the bed and breakfast thing, I just, I really have to go back. It's going to take me a while to go through them. What for, Jack? What did the dub get deported for?
<laughs> yeah, there's loads of people. Everybody's hanging on his every word. The minute we're watching him, he's hanging himself day by day. He just can't help himself. He's one of them people, you know yourselves. He just can't help what he's doing. He's not scary at all. And neither is his recovery tribe. They're all bumbles. I feel sorry for them. They're all running about there like they're hard as fuck on of it harder shapes. <clears throat> Do they not realize that? Well, everybody knows what I've been through. If I'm a back broke, up and stabbed, up and shot, I've had shattered my left arm, I've shattered my left ankle, tore the cartilage in my hip, tore the cartilage in my knee, tore the taliofibular ligament in my hip and my ankle. And you know something? None of them fuckers could keep me down. So if he thinks that he... I'll put her down. I think she needs to go to the toilet. Are you going to the toilet? I don't know. I'm going to have to carry her over to the litter box. She hasn't been all day and I'm trying to keep an eye on. There. There. You show us where to go. I can't. Here, baby, go to the toilet. No. No, you don't sit down in there. You go to the toilet. I'm sorry for this week, girl. She's just... She doesn't know what to do. She's lost her. I got her yesterday, and she's so timid. And the other boys growling at her. <laughs> Not at the minute. I need to tidy up here. Um... I haven't done much today, and um, they've kicked they've kicked the food all around the floor. And um, there's bits of cat food, and they've kicked the litter all around. Is that Malcolm's? But is it Malcolm's? I don't know. I don't know where the small comes or not. I don't really care. Like he's not intimidating me. That's the thing. See, for a lot of these laws, you need to actually be afraid, and I'm not. But I've had bigger shapes. Honestly, I'm not worried about them one bit, and I'm not worried about anyone in the recovery tribe. But if they came around here asking questions about me, they'd get a flame in their ear. What's wrong? What's wrong, me girl? Do you hear her? Oh, she's going. Good girl. She's went. Brilliant. Another one that her trained. Nailed it. She was down to go to the toilet. He is spineless. Sorry, I'm... I'm... You coming over? No. I'm going to have to get her out of the toilet. Out of the letters right here. Oh, sorry, baby. Sorry. Just don't want to spring her in case she has to go for a pee stop. I'll show you her now, actually, but it'll only be quick. 
And they said, I don't want to, I don't want to upset her, but she's still very nervous and timid, and I don't want to be holding her in one spot. Are you caring? Look at the other boys in. <laughs> I'll make it get other. <clears throat> the other boys in here, he's not impressed, but I've got her. Hey. How are you, Wayne's legal thing? Right, here we go. This is her. Mere messes. Me later. There you go. Mere messes. Like? What? This is her. I haven't named her yet. I really haven't. I haven't thought anything to call her yet. She's very, very, she's very, very timid. She's afraid. So I'm letting her, I'm sort of letting her. Ah, the other boy, he's overwatching. He's jealous. He doesn't know what to do. Ah, I took him up beside me up and giving him loads of reassurance, telling him that he's my, he's my baby boy still. She is gorgeous. She's got the funniest wee meow. She just goes, meow. <laughs> Don't you, baby? You got a cute wee meow. Yes. But she's sitting on my lap now, you know, she's she's not as bad as she was yesterday. No, I'm not going to call her pocket. See, I, I got to see, I've already my, um, my boy cat, he's jet black too. And then I got her. Now she's black, jet black, because I want to breed them. But um, I heard there's a lot of demand for black pussy. So, yeah, um, I said I want to breed them. Uh, so I heard the people go mad for black pussy. All right, there you go, man. Yes? No, no, no. I, I could probably think that he was going to the toilet, too. He does actually hasn't minded sharing his litter box with her. For now, I don't, I don't like the idea of him sharing a litter box. I might. Uh, it's our shit stinking. She just done one there. His his never stinks. You alright, wee man? Monkey. She's sitting looking at monkey here. She's so cute, aren't you? Look at them wee eyes. She's got she's got like blue around her pupils and like wild green. Did somebody say black pussy? I, I don't know. I just... I don't know. I'll, I'll, I'll find something for her. I want to... I want to see, I waited, I waited until I seen what his personality was like, and you can't really see until you have them for a week or so, you know, to sort of see what they're going to be like. But she was very, very frightened earlier, and, like, you'll see now, like, not a, not a, not a budge out of her, she's happy. She's just content to sit in my knee now. Monkey, what are you getting in that? Do you hear him growling? He sits and growls at her. Well, she's, she's sort of learned that I'm... She sort of went... I had to pin her yesterday. I pinned her in the duvet. I went to lift her away from him because he was being grumpy. And she tore shreds out of me in my hand. I had to pin her and wrap her in a towel. Yeah, she and he does love sex, like she says, she's an addict. I'm going to have to spend a bit of time with him now. You know, I 
Pat Hurt go into our wee box, sir. You go in there, Pat. And go on in there. Lie down. Good girl. That's a good girl. You go and sit down. Here's a wee drink of water for you here. There's your wee drink. I'm getting her wee drink of water there. This is just after going to the toilet. I won't see him, see how he is. Where are you going, baby? Where are you going? What you doing, wee man? Mary sees you. No. Me. Good boy. Yeah. Yeah, he's he's jealous here. He likes he loves he's he's had my on on damn attention for weeks now. Over a month I think I have him and he's been getting my on damn attention. Every single day it's him, 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 him. And since I got her here, he's just felt left out yesterday, haven't you, baby? You want away? No, all right, wee mom. It's very warm. Tell me this, Lorraine Kelly, is it warm where you are the day? I'm absolutely melted here, Arma. Arma in Belfast. Arma's not in Belfast, you dick. Arma is Arma. Full stop. Belfast is not a very big place. Belfast is about three miles from one side to the other. Armagh is 45 miles away from Belfast. It is a city in a county that contains the same name, Armagh. Belfast is in County Antrim. Not County Armagh. County Armagh is a county. Armagh City is a city within a county where both cathedrals of St. Patrick, the Roman Catholic, and the Protestant ones are sited in Northern Ireland. Just think, I've never met anyone as stupid in my life. Like, he honestly thinks he's intelligent, the way he's coming across on his legs, or coming across as nothing but a bullish thug. Trying to intimidate people, trying to make people think that you're more than you are. You're nothing but a little rat, a wee drug dead on rat from Salford. As I've said on numerous occasions, I've had bigger shakes. You don't intimidate me on in the slightest. Lorraine Kelly, did you not hear my pretty funky joke? Or I said they're both black. Lorraine, I said both cats are black. And I was thinking of breeding them, but I heard there's a lot of demand for black pussy. Who did Whitney the deliberately rolled up her t shirt? <coughs> God bless them. Like, they're really not the brightest bunch in the world, the recovery tribe. I take everything he says with a pinch of salt. Honestly, sure, Mark. Didn't Mark Chapman tell me back at the start of April that? The ultra paramilitaries from Donny Gold were coming to get me and I laughed in his face too and I'm still sitting here. Do your worst little day. Everyone's laughing at you. Literally everybody. Yeah, Jack, there's nothing to worry about, especially not with him. He's all mouth. I don't care what gangs he thinks he's wrapped up in. I know people that wouldn't pick candy to the likes of him, carrying out threats like that there. He deleted it, Julie. But don't worry, we keep them. I'm... I'm actually not saying anything bad about him. 
all I done was made memes about his mom. And if he can't take it, he shouldn't be dragging her into things and saying she was a drug dealer. Yeah, it's not even an IRA. It's not even an IRA saying. It's an old wife saying. My nanny used to say it. You'll soon learn the area of ways. My nanny used to say it, and my nanny was not in the IRA. Lorraine Kelly, have you ever heard that there? You'll soon learn the area of ways. He brings danger everywhere he goes, Sam. His kids' moms need to take a stand. When it comes to having that man in their lives. But he's going to end up getting his kids in trouble too. Like, what happens if some of their friends got to see the way he got on? He has nothing. He's he's pushing all the wrong buttons with me. You know something? I'm about as scared of James Davenport as I'm um, of my cat. Cats, eh? and I'm not afraid of my cats. He probably didn't, Dolly and Julie. It could, Facebook could have took it down because loads of people reported them for terrorism and inciting violence. And the moment he gets a ban on that page, the other one's gone. He was stupid doing all them threats on his shinies page. He has no brains, that man. If brains were made of dynamite, he wouldn't have enough to blow his nose. Does anybody want to come on yet? Anybody fancy chatting to me on live here? It's not overly scary. Like, trust me, it's easy enough. Hang on. Where did my chop bubbles go? <laughs> oh, lovely. One of our meme creators sent me a load of memes there. I'll use them. Thank you very much, Mimi. If the person that makes some of my memes for me is here, thank you very much. I'm going to use him. Well, three of them. <laughs> I'm, eating, I'm eating a multi pack ice pops here. I've ate one already today. I think I'll have a cola one this time. My stomach's giving me bother and I'm absolutely starving because I've been eating proper. Um, I think he's going to lose to both of them too, Ashton. 
he will lose Maxine and he will lose the page. It's just a matter of time because he can't help himself. He's a horrible excuse for a human being, but oh well. Well done, Claire. That's absolutely amazing. I was actually talking to a, grand, a taxi driver the other day. And I said, I can't wait. To, I'm a grandfather, but I absolutely adore kids. Like, you know, it's going to be great to have a bit of life around the house again. Someone, a couple of kids to play PlayStation with. I can't wait. <laughs> They'll go through all that again, because I'm done past the age of having any more myself. Oh, Kim, that's a joke. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just relaxed this evening. Can't believe there's 60, 70 is sitting here listening to my bullshit. <laughs> you must have not asked that I... <laughs> Who here thinks, let's have a poll, let's uh, have a competition to see who can guess what his next lie is going to be. Come on guys, what's his next lie? I know what his next lie is going to be. He's going to blatantly outright say that I threatened him with the IRA, any money. And he's that stupid, he doesn't realise that uh, that's not going to be a possibility. And even if I was going to threaten some paramilitaries, it wouldn't be them. And for Maxine being so much Irish, you think she would have sat back and explained the political situation over here to Little D? Oh, it's brilliant, Sadie. It's good to hear you're eating again, Sadie. Eating's important. When I was really sick, or I couldn't eat, and I found it made things. I don't know. There's no Irish on her. She can tell by her accent. And they Yeah. He can't do nothing to lay on it seconds as whole. He's that's why he tried to say Lee message Maxine. Now he's making up lies about me. I'll stand up and I'll say, yeah, I sent that picture to him. But I didn't send the woman. And that was my crime. But he's done the exact same as me. He took a picture of a woman's kids off Instagram, or Facebook, and put them on his Instagram. Yeah, Kathy, he's he's an absolute scumbag. It was an old woman who was angry at him because he went to Cyprus during lockdown and she was concerned because they couldn't even leave the house, never mind him coming into the country with God knows what diseases. That's why the old woman was taking the pictures.
Kathy, there's no proof. But it didn't happen. There's people here now who are in the chat can tell you he's full of crap see he thinks that it was inboxed I think he's got it into his head that that picture was sent to me in a message he doesn't realise that it was sent into a group chat yeah he harassed that woman in Cyprus she was petrified of him I told my truth That's my truth. How do you say it? But uh, that's my truth. Ooby dooby doo. <laughs> you know, you haven't been laughing much this past few days, little day. What's wrong? Did somebody turn your mum into a pepper army? That's my truth. Mm. Laura White, if you don't want to use your na real name, don't use it full stop. If you don't feel comfortable, if you don't feel, if you feel that you're going to be harassed under your real name, don't reveal it to anyone. You don't need to. We don't expect people that are friends with us here to reveal who they are because you can tell the content of a person's character by talking to them. Thank God it's cooling down. It's been very warm today. His behaviour is manic. Kathy is absolutely up and down. He's up and down like a yo-yo. Um, I just... I feel bad for the people around them. You know, the family that have to deal with someone with a personality disorder like that, it must be exhausting. It was, I just, I think Maxine has just seen the fun side of him at the start, and now she's in too deep. Like, I say she would get rid of him in a heartbeat if she wasn't in too deep. Come on, mm -hmm. yeah, from them trying to get ba 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 my dead of going under. Look, see if see if he stopped begging for money and stop trying to encourage new people into his tribe. I wouldn't care if the people that were there already for that their long time with him kept paying him. I wouldn't care. It's the fact that he keeps trying to entrap more vulnerable people that keeps me going, and I can't I can't let that happen in all good faith, honestly. Someone else is going to lose their life. I don't, like I, I, I maybe did come at this at the start from a selfish, selfish perspective. Yeah, I didn't like what I was doing, but yeah, it was fun back then. It was real fun. But now he's trying to ensnare. He, he was stopped there, and I didn't mind keeping quiet when he was stopped. I didn't mind what he was saying about me when he was stopped. When he had no subscriptions or ability to take money off people or entrap other people, but there was nothing enticing about what he was doing. He had stepped away from the sock from the Senate Shinny's page, the recovery side of things. He had stepped away from that there, and that didn't bother me one bit. 
things were ticking all over along over nicely there there was a group of people that were talking to Ryan and all and they were going with him every single night and he had a nice wee set of viewers he maybe only had about 90 viewers but it was a good group of people they were you know and he wasn't he wasn't taking advantage of anyone then but now he's got the subscriptions back he's back to the same shit begging and scrounging and took I haven't seen Ryan on that Shinny's page once since he took it over again. It's disgusting. I've spoke. He he forgets that I've spoken to people that have come out of that tribe, and the set is just a knocking shop. And it also says there's two tier, two groups of people in there. There's one, there's a top tier of people in there. And if you're not running in with the top tier of people, if you're not with them, you don't get any acknowledgement in the tribe. And that there's the way it goes in there. If you're not in with Whitney and the Walton and all them ones, if you're not in with them, you get ignored. I don't know. I haven't seen Ryan since Shinny took the page back. Shinny provides no help to people in recovery at all. All he does is go on daily and moan about trolls and how he had the big page and how he helped people, but I've been at this from the start of April, and I have never, maybe the end of March, no monkey, I've been at this from the edge, end of March, and there's absolutely zero he does for that page. He does nothing for them. Here. Sorry, I'm talking to monkey here. Hmm. Don't look at her. Don't look at her. Don't look at her. You don't need to see her. <laughs> he's afraid of her. He's twice the size of her and he's scared of that wee kitten. Maybe that was just his reason for walking away from Shinny, do you not think? That's the same for anyone watching here. If you want to interact with us, you don't need to use your real name. Just come on here and speak your mind under any name you want. There's no pressure in here to reveal yourselves or anything to do with you because everyone's seen how the tribe react when people use their proper face and name. They try to shame them people. I went on to Shinny's Live and I showed my face and he said, look at me, we, we are dirty clothes that were only out of the washing machine on your stinking teeth. Well... You can't see my teeth, but unfortunately, the shape of my mouth is not that way inclined, so you couldn't have seen them either when I was talking. You're a silly man. Huh. Oh, I'm sorry. What's up, uh, Lorraine? Uh, comment, uh, posted a uh, message there where you asked me.
card and that she knows. He is a stinker. Well, he said my t-shirt was dirty, so I was just going to comment on the stinking top head. Welded them with sweat the night before. It was still on him. Yeah, Joe Rimmer, he is a predator. I can't believe that that there woman went through that there after losing her baby and then members of the tribe trying to get to their home. It would have been different if it was a female, but that's not a female. And we all, look, we all know what he was trying to do. There's no sense in trying to sugarcoat it. We all know what Joe Rimmer was trying to do by getting to that woman's house. And it makes me sick. Kathy, she was licking up the shinny because she thought that I don't know, maybe her ex wouldn't take her back, and that's why. See, Shinny was a catch money wise whenever she met him. He had a solid income from vulnerable people. Hi, Jill. How are you? Shani was on earlier making a Threats of violence. Well, Jaden, threats of violence. He was talking about Maxine's family being in Ireland, wanting to know what's going on. And under the same breath, talked about the IRA. So... Inciting violence and terrorism. Yeah, I say she, he'd probably hit her. I say he would hit a woman, not a problem. Not when she's pregnant. Maybe he'd be a bit restrained, but I say he would. If he was drunk, I say he'd lift his hand. There you go. Hell. Ex-tribe member kicked out for having an opinion. Or um, Joe Rimmer, there's another one, says Joe Rimmer talks to me in my inbox under my real name, but I don't know how to say stop. I feel awkward. I always stay quiet as I can. But I feel awkward as lots of men pester me now. Tell them to fuck off, Laura, on their real account. You don't need to speak to someone that you don't want to. That's just the way the world is. You have rights. Tell him to go away. Tell him you feel. Tell him you, he's making you. He, he's making you feel creepy. 
that's the best way to handle a man. It'll dent his ego at the same time, but you have to be blunt. That's what the block button is there for, block them. Don't feel bad. You are not obligated to talk to anyone you don't want to. He's a creepy wee man. See, the more he's doing at the minute against us, the more is coming out about him. There's some stories coming out now. Joe Groomer. That's his name. Change it from Rimmer to Groomer. See, if you say anything that Whitney ponders to him, to his narcissistic tendencies, Whitney tells him, it's okay, it's okay, you're okay to behave like that. I do protect you from anyone that tries to tell you that you're doing something wrong. So she's the downfall of that page because he doesn't get to see the comments that are constructive. And he isn't able to take the criticism. Joe Rimmer must be messaging every woman in that tribe. It's all coming out now. See, Shinny's behaviour and drawing more people towards this page. He's pushing people towards us, and that there means that the people that have stories to tell are coming and telling us them. It's the biggest mistake of his life, mentioning me over and over again. If he had any sort of business acumen and sense, he would learn to keep his mouth shut. But he's an idiot. Great idiot. <laughs> Dr. Nick. Hey, everybody. I'm Dr. Nick. <laughs> Isn't Dr. Nick the quack from the Simpsons? I would ask that anybody that has any info on the on shape on him anyone that has any stories on Shinny, feel free feel free to message this page. Don't say anything private or personal if you're messaging the page, but if you have any stories about the tribe, any stories about little day common Message the page, inbox the page. Mm. 
Mm. Two seconds, guys. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's all. Oh, definitely, Jack. Definitely. Mr. Mackey. Drugs are bad, I'm gay. I used to love the South Park. It was funny. Out and make nice pops. You definitely were, Charlotte. Definitely were. It's disgusting the things that go on over there. What are you here, baby? He's up on his back feet, look. He was up on his back leg, sir. He heard a strimmer going off out the back. Oh, I don't know that from up there, so you can see what's going on. No. Mm. Mm. No. <laughs> He's a wee shit. He runs away from me now because he's afraid of the girl cat. Oh, no, baby. <laughs> now I know where the sand scurdy cat comes from. He's really, really, he's really, really doing himself damage. The more he mentions my name, the more people are going to find out who I am, the more people are going to come over here that's been victims of his bullshit. I spoke to loads of victims. And you're not the first people to say that the tribe is a date in a knocking shop. That's what they called it, a knocking shop. Absolute joke, but I was. God save me. God loves a trier, don't they? Right, I'll have to read the comments again here. So it's the weather for a second. I wasn't looking at the screen. But it he offers the world at a price, but he can't deliver the world. There's nothing to deliver. He has never once delivered on his promises to anyone. Anything he says he does, he doesn't do it.
he can't release that book now because he has said that he's and it's full of lies. He's he's admitted that his book's full of lies. He said it today. Oh, I was making that up. He's destroyed it. Hundred percent, Sergio. Never was gonna. That's because there is no book. Honestly, anything that he would publish would be laughable. What's the bad shimmy of a dead before the year is out? Because he's going to get killed for crossing someone on Facebook. I guarantee it. He's going to say something to the wrong person. And they're going to take parts of him and mail them back to his family. He probably still thinks I am out as the party capital of the world. He honestly does, and he honestly thinks he's going to make a fortune selling drugs there. Do people still go to Cyprus party and die in Appa in the summer? Sorry, Lee sent me a message, sir. Let me go and check this. Oh, yeah, guys, I have another account for, I have another backup account. Um, I made a load of accounts years ago, and I still have them all. Um, you'll see it posting about in a minute. Um, so if I get one of mine, I have about 20 other accounts lined up, some in my name, some not in my name. Sorry, there's a message from Lee, I meant to see that. I'm just answering Lee here. Um. Talk amongst yourselves, or we'll back in a second. Yes, hold on. There we go. I can't look at that on the live. Oh, hold on. Maybe I can.
Yeah. Shinny Bo out fucking advertising all the world to say he's I I'm, I'm laughing all I'm here inside. I'm just having giggles inside my head. He's just an idiot. There's nothing he has nothing to offer the world of recovery. I wish he would just stop. As I told him the other day, no more lives. I actually can. Hold on, I'm going to mute a second here to listen to this voice clip. Sorry, I was listening to I was talking to Lee there. Um, does he not realise that he's doing wrong when there's so many people are standing up against him? He does want money an easy way. He's never worked a day in his life. I've worked all my life up until 2014. <laughs> and I spent years studying to get a job. And what has he done? Sold drugs and begged to be famous. He doesn't care about his tribe, sir. He's no high authority to look down on anyone. He's a scumbag. He's going to hurt someone else. and I'm not going to sit back and let him. Like, all I've done so far is for the picture, have an argument with him, pointing out what he was doing wrong, and maybe maimed his mum as a pepperami, but he shouldn't be bringing people into the social arena if he doesn't want them mentioned, and especially saying not to sell drugs for him. Today it does feel like a very long shin day. <laughs> Sam, you're burnt out. Shinned out of the back teeth. Oh, it's all right, Sam. It'll be a new day tomorrow. Guarantee it. Bright and early. He'll be up like five o'clock this morning and he started fucking messaging me. Five o'clock this morning, would he catch himself on? I was only getting my second sleep at that time. And he's, why is he crying about his mum being named as a pepperami when he... Oh, there we go. When he... Uh, man, when his, uh, just talking shimbo here, it's just me and you, mate. That's all right. So, I'm jumping for you while we man. More ex tribe members have found their way over here to tell us stories. Is that good? That's good. That's good. That's yep. That's every Sorry. time I do, every time I do a lively, more and more ex tribe members are coming over to tell us how things went for them. All right, all right. Because I can imagine there was, there's been a lot of stories that have, uh, that are sort of the same. Do you know what I mean? It's all coming out that it was one big dating scene that everybody was riding each other and handing each other about for raids. Not theirs, what right. the tribe was like. Yeah, yeah. Um, that could well be true because um, the um, 
Oh, what was it? Where, where, where he used to go away? He used to go in a retreat or something. They used to go away on a retreat and he was shagging them all and that. Um, so, yeah, that wouldn't surprise me. Maybe that's why that fucking uh, dodgy rimmer geezer um, jumped straight on that fucking that, that lady. That's disgusting, man. So it's disgusting. Yeah, no, it, it, it did me. I, I couldn't believe what I was hearing. When I heard that. I thought, what the fuck? She's, she, she's gone on there for help and you're fucking on her inbox trying to fucking chat her up. What the fuck? It's disgusting. Oh, did you read the messages? No, I didn't. Uh, no, what, in the, in the com- uh, comments? No, I can't remember. No, they were, they were posted. Are you not in the shiny, sh- the shiny shiny show? All right. Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, I did. Oh, right. Was that it? him fucking... Um, was that him talking then? In the messages. Talking to her? Yeah, that was Joe Rummer. Trying, trying to get yeah. round to the lady's house. I think she's in the comments, sir. Fucking hell, man. That's madness. So it's dangerous, isn't it, eh? Dangerous. What do, what do you thought he was going to do? Fucking go around and just just help you out or something? Do you know what I mean? Yeah, he was on the live where he tried to say, I said to him, you'll soon learn the error of your ways. And he tried to say that that was an IRA saying. And, the, and then he started talking about Maxine's family and the IRA under the same breath. It was have to threaten me with him. He was using jaded threats the whole life. He's a twisted bastard. Oh, trust me, Stuart. You, you, uh, Shinny, and all that ain't fucking, and me uh, ain't um, important enough for the IRA, mate. Don't worry about that, fuck's sake. Fucking no, IRA, the wouldn't, the wouldn't bother me. Of course I wouldn't. Of course I fucking wouldn't. No, he tried to say it. Yeah. He tried to say that I was a member of Power Milbury's too, and then. He just, he, I, I, I made it pretty clear back at the start that I had nothing to do with him. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, I don't know. He's he's very, very twisted. He's trying to twist things around. He's trying to get well, people in. Said, what did Shinny say to you earlier, the cunt? Said that you're, yeah, like, you're, you're involved in one of the trees. What's he up yeah. to? He's, 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 that guy's is on drugs, mate. I'm telling you, he's on fucking drugs. And feathers on drugs. Fucking coked up cunt. Doing a live and then what taking it down? Weirdo. He is, but we've all got his lives. I'm gonna hand him over to Interpol. He's making jaded threats. <clears throat> uh, yeah, he, do you know what? He, he, yeah, he is. He is. Yeah, he really is. Um, yeah, yeah. He, he needs to be fucking careful, man. He needs to be careful and do what you got to, do, Stuart. If you, if you feel threatened, fucking uh, do what you got to, do, man. Definitely. Um, I'll do exactly the same. I'll do exactly the same. Yeah, I, there's no other way for it. I'm going to have to say that he's doing Facebook lives and he has hundreds of people watching him and he's making jaded threats to me. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's that's the one thing I didn't like when I come back from holiday. Uh, I've been threatened and I, and I hate that. Do you know what I mean? I've been fucking hell, man. I, I, I don't like shit like that. Yeah, um, it, 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 um, it, it makes me anxiety at the roof. Do you know what I mean? Um, and, and that's why I had to um, speak to some some fellow about it because it because it just fucking drove me mad. You know what I mean, I thought, what's fucking shit you doing? Fucking trying to fight me, uh, trying to get people to uh, beat me up or something, box me or whatever it fucking was. Uh, the Lee Green's boxing tent or something. That threat. Oh, I didn't think it's a fucking all right, but you know what I mean? He was saying... This will start fucking threatening Chippy, eh? Come on. I'll fucking threaten you, Chippy, silly cunt. What airport are you coming back on next, eh? Me and Leo will be waiting for you. Fucking mug. Most probably on here now. I'll do a different fucking... Uh, you, that, that's supposed to be you, you wonder. <laughs> no, I mean, as he goes, he's quite funny. <laughs> He threatens, but he's okay. He is. Do you know what he does, though? Why? And this is bollocks. He, he, he gets, he, he, he does threats and he talks, but people are mentally un- unstable, right? And they take it off their own back to do his shit. Do you know what I mean? Uh, just because they think that they get a mention or, or a fucking, I don't know, or a pat on the back by him or, or even a, an acknowledgement. 
people, with their, with their are people that would do that. Do you know what I mean? I.e. the guy who knocked on Wayne's, Wayne's door. That could have been fucking a hell of a lot worse, that. Do you know what I mean? Wayne could have been mental, uh, opened the door and stabbed the cunt. Do you know what I mean? Or, or wherever. Playing dangerous games again. Again, isn't he? So, yeah, he, he just keeps playing up. In fact, he just keeps playing up. And he don't understand what we're trying to say to him. Do you know what I mean? We ain't a fucking vendetta. We, 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 we're not a fucking uh, thing against him. Which is fucking uh, don't like people who are charging to Pierce Paul. He can't even back it up. Do you know what I mean? He can't even back the fucking thing up. No fuck all to do with it. But yeah, that, this is what he don't like. He don't like us um, keep on keeping on at him because uh, because he burst his bubble and he don't like it. Come. Well, it's the truth. It's Everything we're saying is truly. Yeah, it's true, yeah. Yeah, it's true. It's true. And if him friends go and deck us fucking lives and shit like that, who gives a fuck? Fuck you, know, good luck with that, you know what I mean? Uh, like Lee, what did he say when I said about Hold on to get this up. What did he say when I said about his mum selling his drugs for him? What did he say about his mum? Oh, right, yeah, no, yeah, but he, he backed it up, didn't he? He backed up, he went, uh, did the dirt, wait a minute, something about lying or something. Uh, something like, yeah, he called me a liar. Lying. Yeah, he, call, yeah. he called me a liar first. Was you a liar? I my mum, believe it or not. I've <laughs> one of my regular clients from my youth. Things of people selling gear for me, including my mum, believe it or not. I'd give it to one of my regular clients from my youth who would buy a few bags of whiz every day. Really? Things of people selling gear for me, including my mum. Including his mum. Yeah. Hey, yeah. guys. So what did he say when I said him? Yeah. Hello, Sadie. Love you, all right? You too, yeah, you're all right. You're all right. I just wanted to yeah. say, um, yeah. I know there's a couple of uh, tribe members and ex-tribe members here watching. <laughs> Yeah. Um, I just want to say you're not daft for joining there and falling for everything he says. Please don't ever feel daft from that because you're not and it will just wind you up even more feeling that. Yeah, um, the best there, yeah, and you know, there's one lady on here um, and it's, she she said in the comments, Joe. I don't know if you said if you seen, but she said that no. she'd um tried putting up a post. She's on a different name on there. I say not um, earlier. She tried putting up a post in the tribe asking if men couldn't inbox her, and what? the post got declined. Oh. Um. Wow. Yeah, wow. the post got declined. Uh, he's supposed to be going to her house on the weekend. Oh, my and God. And he's worried that if she says no, he's going to turn up anyway. So she says she's just going to let him. But No, you don't have to do that. Please. Yeah, no, you I'm, don't. Yeah. Well, no, no, you don't. If you don't want to go in your house, don't you? Do you say no? Say no, I don't want you to go in my house, thank you. Yeah. Do you need do you need help and support or do you need help to get away from the tribe or to find people that'll help you for free where you won't have to worry about people inboxing you looking to go to your house and meet you? It's absolutely disgusting what's going on. See yeah, people yeah. are obviously yeah, there true. for yeah. look yeah. help. Yeah, um true. Jack, I have that's I have true. told her to do that, honey. I have said, you know. Um I know she's watching, so I know that everything you're saying she'll be seeing. Um, yeah, I, I've been messages. speaking to her. I'm in a like little chat with her and a couple of girls from the tribe, so we're just talking oh, at the moment, know. which is nice. But um, but yeah, yeah so please, Look, I... please take notice in every single one of these messages you're going to get on these comments now, because these are the kind of messages you need to be taking notice of, because you know. Um, it's very easy to feel unsafe, okay? It's very easy to feel unsafe. 
but we can do things to present ourselves like to prevent ourselves from being unsafe like you know um by not going to the police and speaking to the police about it because I just cannot say enough, you know, like you shouldn't have to feel like you have to stay somewhere because you don't know what to do because people's got your address. Like, oh my God, what? Like, I'm really sorry. Why does anyone have to give their address to be in a group? Can I, can I just, can I just say something there? Look, see, we do love taking the piss out of Jenny, a.k.a. Chippy. But our main priority here is you guys' safety and making sure that you're safe from any form of emotional and psychological abuse that goes on in there, such as feeling Blackmail. pressured, blackmailed and pressured into going, yeah. people going to your house. That is not the case. That should not happen. If you need help or support, Speak to Sadie there. She will pass you on to my inbox and I will try and work out some way to get you away from it and try and make sure that it's dealt with in a manner that you don't have to feel awkward about people coming to your house even after you've left that situation. It's toxic over there and it's the start of your own journey in recovery to get away from that as well. And we will help you find support and help for free on here. That's our main concern. It's not making fun out of Shinny. Yes, it's trying to annoy him a bit, like, but our main concern is people like yourself. And that's all that matters. We want to try and get you away from it. We're not here just for banter. Yes, we're funny fuckers, but we do care. <laughs> well said, man. Well said. Well said. See, I'm not articulate. I can't fucking give the words out probably, but uh, yeah, what Stuart just said, what Stuart just said, definitely, definitely. You shouldn't feel emotionally blackmailed to um, your addiction, you know what I mean? It's, it's, it's a liberty, it really is a liberty. Um, and um, the, the pain bit is a big thing for me, you know what I mean? Because at the end of the, end of the day, you, you, well, you are just emotionally blackmailed to your fucking, to the time. And, 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 and some people do feel silly, don't they? They do feel silly that, uh, that, they, that this man's took advantage of them and shit like that. But it happened to me. It happened to Sadie. Fucking, uh, well, it didn't have a Stuart, just because Stuart didn't even go in. But, yeah. Uh, I would just like to say, look, uh, you don't, you're not stupid. You're trusting. And I hope that this one bad experience won't damage that their trust that you have. Don't feel yeah, that exactly. everyone's out there is like out there. It's just this one man. And that's why so many people have turned on him. It's because he's vile. Don't feel it stupid. Feel, feel you're a good trusting person and that their trust has been betrayed. And don't feel stupid because of it. I'm a very trusting person, but I've learned not to let things like that upset me. If I do get caught out by someone who's not as nice as the seem at first, but hey, look, there's loads of us here. There's literally hundreds of us that will help you. And um, we're mostly good people. There is some that mightn't be as good as the rest, but we will offer you the help that we can. The good yeah. ones will stand out from the rest. Um, but yeah. yeah. Absolutely. So, uh... The worst thing is a, is a bad experience for each other, didn't you? Do you know what I mean? That's the, worst, that's the last the worst experience yeah. you want. I mean, but you've took the first to step. Talk. You've yeah. took the first step. You've started talking to someone about the negative experience, and that there's always the first step in getting away from toxic situations and getting into recovery is to talk about the problems that are surrounding you. And you've took the first steps, which is absolutely amazing. And um, look, we're all here to support you. Sadie is one of the loveliest people I've ever met. She takes on an awful lot of responsibility on top of her own problems, so that there is commendable in my book, City, or a brilliant person. Yeah, um, absolutely. Yeah, you'll get all the help you need over here to find the proper help. We might yeah. be the ones that would be able to advise you or help you properly, but we'll make sure you get to a place where it's safe. Yeah. I see the comment. I actually think they're breaking. 
They all got my address because I had to go to join in the first place, which I didn't join because I live here. Sadie, please can you call me? I'm going to go so, and call her. Sorry, did I have to give uh, the addresses out and shit, do I? Um, I'm going to go. She's asking okay, so yeah, right. call her. So oh, I'm going to jump. Sorry, love. No um, oh, if you're on later on, I'll come back on, all right, guys? Yeah, I'll speak to you later. Okay, Felix. I'll ring you now, Thanks. honey, all right? Bye. Bye. See you later. Bye-bye. There you go. She's done so much to help ex-tribe members this past couple of days. She really has. Yeah, she really has. Uh, yeah, I don't know how she does it. I really don't. I really don't. Um, and, yeah, yeah. And she's one of the most calmest, calmest people I've ever met in my life. She calms me down. She's a lovely wee voice. It just makes you want to cry oh, sometimes. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I know, I know, I know. And it takes people like that who's gone through fucking absolute hell. Do you know what I mean? To um, to help others, man. And uh, that's why she certainly knows. Absolutely, Tracy. amazing person. Can you leave Robinson. Me, how do I get on the stream? Uh, Tracy, there's a um, da, 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 um, can we put the link down or anything? Um, there is a comment there, read the pinned comment, Lee. Oh, his address, oh, self, self, my video, really? Oh, I had his address, uh. Uh, gin and alcohol or something in America. No, it's just it's just a it's just a video of him walking around talking about how he is so great and how his recovery oh, is brilliant. Really? What that's the that's the fucking end of it. <laughs> the fuck? Fuck you. Know. Like do you know what I've noticed? See people from the tribe that have come over to us to talk to us. Yeah. They feel like they're part of something now. They don't feel like they're following someone. They feel like they're part of something bigger than themselves. And that there's a good thing for people in recovery. It really is. Yeah, it really is. Uh, yeah, I, yeah. I get it that people join the tribe uh, for Shinny and think that Shinny's going to be there and think that they're going to get his help and all that. But unfortunately, when I find that, <clears throat> they ain't, that he ain't there. It's like kicking the teeth, isn't it? Really. Well, Paul, like I guess here, Lee, um, the first step in my recovery was starting, well, it was admitting that I had a problem on moving forward yeah. with it, but <clears throat> I find what helped me keep, helped keep me focused was focusing on helping other people and trying to make sure I was making a difference because it makes you feel good to help other people. It really does. Um, it, if anything it helps you, you in your recovery, um, yeah, it does. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's one of the best things you can do, really. Um, help other people. Stops you being so selfish as well. If you know what I mean. Oh, Glee. Hopefully, we'll drop off Shani a second. My other cat is jealous. I'm scared. My boy cat twice the size of the wee girl, and he's afraid of her. <laughs> he won't. He, he he will only come in the room if he's looking something to eat or to take a drink. Oh, I want. I didn't know you had another cat. Oh, why you had the you had the boy cat at first, then, did you? I got another one. Um, to keep him company, and he doesn't like her. <laughs> oh. What's this hell? Fucking you know what? Uh, you know the worst part is when it's hard to say we are vulnerable. Uh, what's upset me most is there's no excuse to sweat nothing. So, excuse me for a part of something, but to me, the question was thrown out and lost everyone in the tribe. See, it's bollocks. Mind you, don't mark it. You don't, you know, that's that. Do you know what? Um, hell, um, that must have happened to quite a few people. Uh, well, I know for a fact it happened to me. 
And I know for a fact it's happened. Yeah, definitely just quite. But that's how they used to feel, do you know what I mean? It's, it's bang out of order. I don't know how long it man. It's a strange group, really. It is a strange group. Cannot see the link to get on the stream. Tracy wants to come on the stream, Stuart. Right. Um, um, can somebody post a link again, please? I think there's a few people here who have the link. <laughs> As I can't, I've... I don't want to reveal... There it is. Yeah, I don't want to reveal my new alt, my other alt. I've had to start pulling out a council that I've had for 10, 11 years. Oh, it's mad, isn't it? Fucking stupid. Man, of emails I've got. Fucking hell. What's made about fucking 15 emails? About 30 accounts. But the weird thing is, right, I've got about 30 accounts, but it's always my main account. It's always fucking locked down. Do you know what I mean? 30 day ban, 30 day ban, 30 day ban. Fucking ridiculous. Yeah, I, I've, they haven't got my mail for anything. They've got my, they've got one of my accounts. The Stuart George one's been hit for about seven or eight violations, but. Yeah. Yeah, I've already had my, uh, my main one today. And when they do, they take everything. This is why I was saying I'm a bit paranoid about all my videos, man. I need to get them all off. I need to put them on a fucking card. Uh, Memory stick or something. Um, then Photoshop sticks. Would that work on Facebook? Does anyone know? Um, I got a ter a two terabyte one on Amazon for twenty two quid. I'll get you one like, and I'll send it over to you. It's all right. I've got one. Thanks, uh, Stuart. Days. Um, so what? I'll just do it in, uh, in a laptop. Hi. Uh... Hey. Right. How are you? <laughs> Oh, we're good. How are you? <laughs> All I've got you, to see, it's amazing that we've got you two guys standing up to this vile man. Oh, thank you. Cool. Cool. Um, I'm yeah. going to start. Can I just share my story? Yes, yeah, work absolutely. away. Yeah, definitely. Um, Make sure. Right. I followed Shinny from the beginning when he was like an entertainer. Um, and I supported him, gave him stars, you know, put money out to it because I thought he was brilliant. He made me happy. He was a great entertainer. He was fantastic. Right? Yeah. So that's all I see him as. And I don't know why, but he's totally gone wrong in where he's going and what he's done. Totally wrong. He could have easily just been an entertainer and that would have been it. Do you know what I mean? But he just went too far. Um, then I bought his silly socks for like 16 quid. Yeah. yeah. And then when he was doing a show, he basically said, you know, about the group that he was doing a group and it was going to cost eight pound odd or something. I put a comment on there and I said, I'm not going to pay that and I'm not joining the group. And I got blocked. I got wow. blocked, right? After paying stars, after supporting that man, and I'm really upset. Um, um, yeah. It's just disgusting. It, it, it is, it is, and, and, and at the end of the day, fucking, a lot of people must feel like you, um, I, can, I can imagine a lot of people have sent him a hell of a lot of money, and they've fucking done a, um, um, an angry face, and they've been blocked, do you know what I mean, and they must think I mean, to themselves, fuck, it, 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 it is disgusting. It is, because at the end of the day, I would be quite happy to have just gave him stars, as, as an yeah. entertainer, I didn't want to go in the group. I didn't, I'm not an alcoholic or anything. I didn't want to go in a group and I didn't want to pay eight pound odd. All I said was, yeah. I don't want to be in that group. I'm quite happy to give the stars and that. But when I, I'd only just bought them socks for 16 bloody quid, right? And then, all because I said I wasn't going in the, in the group, I wasn't paying for it. I got blocked for it. And then when I went to see about getting a refund on the socks, it was like, I just gave up because they were worming the way around to say, you're not getting your refund. I thought, do you know what? Sod it. 
haven't even worn the socks that, since. Why should I go around action. advertising a man? Why should I go around advertising them socks? I'm a runner. There's no way I've had them socks going near my feet to advertise a man <laughs> that can do that to somebody. Yeah, no, no. This is what I mean. He, he, he learned a new word the other day. What was it? Empath? Fucking empath. He, he, he hasn't got a clue, that fella. He really ain't got a clue. He, and then um, I don't got, he thinks emails about his followers. I've got emails, Lee. Emails coming. I've got emails now oh, saying 75% off his stupid socks. No, for oh. fuck's sake. Really? What still? My socks. 75% today for his socks. Fucking hell. So he's, he's, he's just all about money. All about money. So I mean, he's a fun. He's a fun. He, um, yeah, he's all about money. They, they don't care. He only cares about maybe his couple of friends and his family or whatever fuck knows. But he certainly don't care about the people who support him. Certainly don't. Definitely not. I feel for you. I feel bad for anyway, you. Anyway, I just wanted to say me peacefully, but thank you very much, guys. Yeah. Thank you. That's all right. That's all right, Tracy. That's all right. Sorry to hear that, though. Do you know what I mean? You guys are cunt. Very good. Thanks a lot. There you go. Another person. He's got fucking lovely things to say about him. Do you know what I mean? What a nasty person, though, eh? Nasty person. When he lost that big page and all that, all them people who followed him and then, oh, mate. And he, he was, he was just blocking people left, right, sent them money. Right, you're blocked, you're blocked. Because that's what me and you couldn't believe, couldn't we? And fuck me, he's blocking me for a fucking angry face. He's joking. I thought, what? A fucking angry face? And uh, yeah, yeah, blocking you for a fucking angry face. And you might have been a star supporter or something for years. He's so, awesome. guys. Is my mic working? Yeah, it is. All right, yeah, Sam. How you doing, lads? How are you? It's an honor. Hello, Sam. You are my. She didn't know you were ours, Sam. <laughs> Fuck me! I didn't know you were ours. Sam's Irish. Irish, yeah. Did I hear his accent there? Yeah, I did, yeah. I don't know if he's... More, is your mic still on, Sam? You still there? Yeah, Sam's hilarious. I've so, seen some of Sam's post. He's hilarious. Sam Davis. I can't, I can't think. See, I'm terrible with names anyway. Fucking absolutely terrible. Oh, Sam, Sam's been brilliant with me from... The word go. Oh, no. one, one second, it's just uh, mine. Just thought I died. He just said, Oh, cool, man. Cool, cool, cool. Because it, it's good to laugh as well. You know what I mean? You need to be funny. It's uh, at the end of the day, uh, that's why I do my chippy chits too. So, because it's a serious fucking thing, but uh, it, uh, you, need, uh, you need to laugh about it. Otherwise, you'll fucking cry. <laughs> you know what I mean? Thinking about other people and all that. He, he, he hasn't got a fucking clue. And I swear, Shinny, if you're on here tonight, mate, how do you feel disgusted? How do you feel absolutely disgusted with yourself? I'm, I'm just, you know something, it's got to the stage where nothing shocks me anymore about what goes on over there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. And all that um, sex talk and all that, it just, it just, it just, it, 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 it shouts out true. Of course, he, they, 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 Whitney's a fucking sex addict. He's a sex addict. Fucking Joe Rimmer's a fucking bacon. Um, don't know what he's playing at. Um, and apparently it's norm for, for what? Them to shag each other. What the fuck's all that about? I wonder if it's, it's a clicky. Seriously. Fucking hell. And, and it's not going to get any up. better, Lee. No, it won't. It won't get any better. It, it only get it, unless you're the same sort of people killed or same sort of pe people as them. Then, like, then yeah, like, yeah. But it's, but it's people like Stacey who we need to try and catch. 
you know what I mean? They, 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 people uh, they stop fucking giving him money and shit like that. Stop supporting him for fuck's sake. Because because he because he won't he won't care he he he, he, won't, he won't say thank you. He, 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 listen you could send him a fucking million pound and he won't say thank you he won't um it's just it's just who he is and people think that thank God give him more to be alive basically people think that they're his friend they don't know they can't say that he doesn't care about them he only cares about their money and i said this from the word go yeah 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 he's he's a very good manipulator and uh did he go acting school or something didn't he he's he well he well he didn't do a very good job acting and come down on me uh, uh, i'd love a penis from the <laughs> no <laughs> he's away He's always seems to be playing a different person, doesn't he? He, he ain't, do you know what I mean? He's, I don't know, he's, he's always trying to change. Uh, I think he's got a personality fucking disorder, me. So, yeah. He has, I say, his borderline personality disorder. I didn't see you down there, baby. Sorry, the wee man was sitting there. The wee man's laying down the floor there. I didn't see him. <laughs> yeah, my boy, my boy, that we man, so that fucking right across the floor. I don't okay. get to the half of my half of my flat. <laughs> I'm gonna get him a few treats here. He's been brilliant all day. He's just popping up for her yeah. so well, especially in his wee house. I'm glad you got uh, your cats, bro. I'm glad you got them. Come in, mate. Like. It's brilliant company. I just when I got him, I wanted to make sure I was fit to look after one before I got two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We definitely, yeah, we might say. Well, so, the yeah. last, my only, they house cats. Yeah, house cats. I'll not be out of the house. I just I'm trying to find. Oh fucking hell! Spot that. Cat toys you know everywhere. Uh, he thinks how many viewers he had. The means the message is getting across exactly look at that. the only message that is coming across is hatred, narcissism, and eating your own self righteous. Do you know what? Well, I'm so glad that there are people in there right, that are sinning in the past couple of days and um, have just thought, fuck you, mate. You know what I mean? You're all about the money, son. You're all about the money. I think a lot of people have. Um, did, did they? Did someone say four people left the tribe today? I don't know. He had two hundred and one yesterday. Um, well, apparently he's um, got hundred quid. So you would see if it goes up to two hundred and ten, shall we? Right? It never does, does it? Remember, the, was it me and you was looking at numbers before? They never went up or down, did they? Um, they did he buy eight supporters, and you won't even see the numbers go up. Yeah, the, the numbers went up one day at over 10k, and he never had uh, he's the, the viewers never went up over the 80 with Ryan Yates. No, he has Tracy, he has done a very stupid thing, and it's not the first stupid thing he's done either, is it? Do you know what I mean? Um, if you need a safe space, you can also message me. That's cool, hell. That's no manners. He really hasn't. When uh, Maxine bought in that top. Like I said, uh, I noticed straight away there was lemons, melons, and all that on it. And uh, if that was me, I'd I'd have been uh, fucking thoughtful, do you know what I mean? Because he juices and all that. I know why she got him that top, but he just took it as if it was I don't know. He, it's, fuck knows. He just took it. it, it, it well, I don't know. He just fucking took it, didn't he? Took it, put it on, didn't even think fuck all about it. He's basically set up about his mannerisms. You know what I mean? 
He just turned around and said, oh, look, I got a wardrobe. Or do you say I'm not? But he was a stinker. He was wearing... Did you see him last Saturday night? He was, yeah. Do you know what? Why has why he only got three tops? That's mad. That's mad. Fuck's sake. What's up with him? Sure, why wasn't he wearing uh, Maxine Jackson's clothes the last time? He was, he was yeah. Um, when he first went out there, there's a white top, uh, a white and black top um, that, he's wearing, that he wears. And that's Maxine's um, boyfriend. Because obviously he left it out in it. But um, yeah, I don't understand why he doesn't fucking. Oh, I don't know. Fuck knows. I'm going to start judging him just because of the fucking clothes he wears to Trump. <laughs> it's not what he was wearing. It's the fact that he never changed his top the next morning. He was sitting on live on the Saturday night. And honestly, the top was just so stuck to him. He must have been on drugs or something because the sweat was running off him. Yeah, yeah. He looked like a man that had a fate of coke in him, to be honest. Now, I, I, do you know what? Lately, I've seen him looking pissed up and coked up. Uh, I really have. I've, I've seen the glow in his face and all that. It's weird. Really weird. Uh, I've nice. noticed him. There's a few times I've noticed him, and he looked, he looked, uh, he looked stoned last Saturday night. Yeah, it wouldn't surprise me. Yeah, it wouldn't, yeah, it wouldn't surprise me at all. He looked like he'd been smoking, like you know, lay like yourself, like when you're smoking weed, you know what weed smokers look like. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um. Especially when you think that mad thunderstorm's coming over and you start shouting and screaming. Oh, kid. <laughs> Fucking crazy cunt. I know. Thunder, Lord. Let's have you. This is a Cypress thunderstorm. What's a load of shit? They, they, they didn't even thunder, did it? <laughs> yeah. oh, it anyone, seen anyone seen the moon tonight? If you get a chance, have a look. It's beautiful. And yeah, he could he could send a, maybe shouldn't he's got his, his glass sitting out full of full of water the night to collect his moon juice like. Yeah, yeah, his moon water, yeah. That's it. He's getting his moon water. I had Divi, I eh? I thought you thick bastard. You know what I mean? I thought do you want do do you know where water comes from, Chippy? Eh? If you did, then you'd know that it's all fucking moon water you can. It's been sitting in the reservoir for fucking months. <laughs> fucking I mean? idiot. Oh, God. No. Hey, guys. Water. Hi, Sadie. Would you like some, um, would you like some uh, uh, Stewie's moon water? Oh, what's that? Yeah, moon water. Yeah. I don't know what moon water is. When it's a you don't moon. know what moon water is? I leave yeah. a bottle of water sitting out at night to absorb the rays of the moon, and that turns it into moon water, and then I'll drink it the next morning. Oh, my God. <laughs> No, I'm only joking. <laughs> Shinny, Shinny said he does. Shinny said that's how what he does to his water. He says he leaves his water outside overnight to get the moon rays. Yeah, yeah. Well, I definitely won't be doing that then. Um, well, yeah, I'll so I spoke to the girl. Um, I um, oh, yeah. I asked if I can update you a bit on what's going on, but um, so she's she's leaving now. She's left. Um, oh, brilliant. Brilliant. just a bit of what's gone on like the last couple of days um, which I've been said, told I can say yeah. um, she has obviously been getting trouble and she was what well, she's been following for a while now not even just since the other day but for quite a while um, right. she's only young uh, she's quite vulnerable, she lives alone she's got autism uh, and uh so when I found out all of this about him, I asked if it would be okay if I spoke to her mum. Because she's on her own, she's young, she's vulnerable, mm, yeah. you know, and yeah. like so anyway, she gave me her number. Um I spoke to her mum and she's going over her mum's now and they're gonna oh, yeah. contact the police together and go through oh, it yeah. all with the police. Um I've told her that she can inbox any one of you, and that, um, yeah. obviously. Yeah, yeah absolutely. So God bless her. Not, she, not, she's, yeah, a lovely, let, yeah. she's a lovely, she's a lovely lad. She's really nice. She's a really nice girl. So, but yes, yeah, it's, it's just a bit upside down. But she's, she's okay, and she's come away. So that's what's important. Yeah, 
Is that nice one? Nice one, Toby. You're soft. Is that she's that's come away? Fun. So that's good. Yeah, that's the main. That's the fucking yeah. main day. The main bit. You know, but main she thing. said she's gonna stick around. She's just in with the wrong crowd, and she, you know. Yeah. But she said she's yeah. gonna stick around. So, and I do, I do think she will. So that'll be nice. Oh, good. Somebody yeah. else that can, like, come and join us. <laughs> You know I, mean? I, I've actually liked everyone that's come out of the tribe so far for the right reasons. They've all been lovely people. Yeah, they have, yeah. <laughs> oh, they were really out have. Cow yeah, cow they really uh, yeah, yeah, I do. Plus uh, one. Do you remember the page equalizer plus one? Uh, yeah, cow is uh, bay. It's not. Uh, Who is it? It's, Who's uh, Betty? Um, Charmin Carol. Who's oh, that? Well, I thought Carl um, Equalizer Sheen. plus one, it's a page. It used to... Oh, it is, yeah, yeah. Oh, no, yeah, 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 I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He used to take yeah. shots at me and Lee. Yeah. Yeah. Because we're on his page for some reason. Most, uh, the, like most of the tribe I sound just a few bad apples, yeah. Yeah, you're right. I, I talked to a couple of people in the tribe and... They, yeah, they, people know, I'm going to have to make a backup page for this one, uh... Mad Potty's Revenge. <laughs> How many people um, are active in this white boat? Uh, is there many people speaking? There's 200 people in there. Yeah, she's white. left, hon. She's left. People just saying hello every day. It was like a case of when she told me that and showed me all of that stuff on him. Uh, when was it yesterday? I think it was, yeah, yesterday. Um, I was like, oh, fuck. So, and that's when I like sort of made the judgment that she is like proper vulnerable. And, and I thought, oh, god, like, how do I safeguard this girl without like breaking her so, confidence, yeah, like trust in that? And I, so I just asked to talk to her mum. There's the best thing yeah. I could do in a situation where. Do you know what I mean? And what's that? Is it another member who, who was um, saying... It was it, somebody in the tribe, them. yeah. Yeah, she just uh, said there the person was autistic and she's vulnerable and... Yeah, God bless taking her. ...taking advantage of her. Fucking hell. Yeah. It's sad. Yeah, just, yeah, it's really just, sad. Why, why oh. do you like cinema? I don't know. He they, they bought some silly followers as well, which is wrong. You know what I mean? It's fucking madness. Um, they, were, they mostly didn't even know yeah. what page they was on. Fuck's sake. Honestly, right? I'm not even joking. I've, I've seen a like a request box, and you should see one, some, one of their request box. It, it is not even funny. It ain't even laughable. It is, it's just like a... a I don't know, like some kind of horse race for it. Do you know what I mean? Like just bam, 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 bam. Wow. It's crazy. I'll That's be fun. so. I'll be really surprised if there's anyone that comments on that live all the time that ain't got people in their inbox. Does that make sense? And they're just too yes. too afraid to say it. Well, if there is anyone who's, who's getting people in their inbox... Then oh, how? That's what I was going to say, Han. Yeah. How? Am I able to message you after this live? If I can, that would be great. Please, Han. I've got similar say. Yeah. Yeah, see? It, you know... I... Oh, I'm sorry, Han. I hate it. I hate I've the way that saying... it is, you know? But yeah, how if I can message you after, I really appreciate it because I can. Um, it's getting oh, anyone, of anyone here they can really send you know. like some groups and talk yeah. with you and stuff. I'm a proper chatty person, so. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> What's yeah, that? Chatty city. Oh, I am chatty. I don't mean to be so chatty, but I just don't shut up. I don't think Does anyone know it, if Lee Brady got a refund? He only joined for help with drink and didn't even last two advice. Do you know what, right? I have been trying to... Somebody is going to send me... Yep, yeah, somebody's going to send me a um, profile and I'm going to reach out with some 
um, with some uh, recovery pages for him, which I don't mind oh, doing. No, oh, he was in. Show. He's in the oh. Shiny Shiny show earlier. Um, was he? Yeah, he's posted in there about his account being taken out of the tribe or out of the tribe. Oh, brilliant! So I'll be able to just go in there and just reach out to him. <laughs> Oh, did you? But he never got back to me. Oh, did he not? No. Maybe he could get back to you, said he, but. Maybe. We'll see. We'll see. Oh, okay. Lee Brady has his own page as well. He does. Oh, right, yeah. okay. There's too many free groups about. And if you want to do CrossFit, there's YouTube. You don't need to pay to get the help you need. No, you don't. You absolutely don't. And do you know what, right? Some people that I know, I don't because I physically can't because of my paralysis. It's so bad now. But I do know people who video call each other on their tablets, <laughs> watch YouTube on their phone, and then they do exercises and stuff that way with each other. Yeah. You know what I mean? And that all started during lockdown and they've just carried it on. Yeah. So you can do that with people. I mean, it's a bit like, you know, on one phone and you've got to have two devices to be able to do it. But it it is possible. Yeah, of course you can. (laughs) I mean, you know, it it is possible. I just go along and sit there and just chat with them. Or if you need a little group (laughs) or something, if you need a little group of yours, do you know what I mean? If they're like, just uh, bring up your idea, do you know what I mean? That's a great idea, that is. That's exactly it. And I think, like, um, I think what we should do is a couple of us, um, just a couple of us, (laughs) going, like, make a chat or something. Um, Maybe just at the moment, no offence to men, because I know you're all great here, but maybe just a couple of us women make Carrie, a chat. Carrie, I'm sure Carrie would join you. Carrie's a lovely yeah, person. She's just full a of energy. Women. Carrie I'm is very... Nice. I speak to Carrie regular, Lauren. She's one of the nicest people I know. Yeah, she's you know, and just make a chat energy. with a few women in, because if men are like... If the men over there... Obviously, well, I've I've seen texts, and well, we you all have seen from you know one person who was in there, but I've seen some on another level. Do you know what I mean? I've I've seen as well. Um, yeah, it, it is bad, and uh, if they're not going to really come, feel like coming out and talking, does that make sense? So if we make like a little chat with just a couple of women in, yeah, absolutely, then, yeah, like, definitely. and just say on like on the live every now and then that you know, we we do have this chat and. People can join if they want to. And do you know what I mean? Yeah. CD, yeah. It is bad. Yeah, it is bad yeah. how yeah. it's I really bad. I comfortable live with me and I say there's, there is an actual uh, women chat that you can go to. Um, yeah. 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 Great idea. Brilliant. Yeah, I, think Brilliant. I think it's a good idea. Really good idea. Um, but yeah, how it is, hon. I'm just sorry you've had to go through it as well. That could happen as their emotions will be all over the place. One second. I know, and that is kind or very scary. What if somebody took their life over? Yeah. Lee got booted from Shinny Tribe group because he screenshot his own post from the tribe into our groups. Oh my it's god. That's disgusting. That is disgusting. Um, I think I can make a group up for like the tribe. The tribe is full of ex tribe cool. members. Why don't you push people wow. that want a bit of fun, you know, not to focus them. on the recovery into yeah. the tribe tri- tri- as well? That belongs to Melanie Har, so I give it to her. Yeah. Second, I just can't just like oh, catching up on comments. Um. I'll show you it will make them smile. <laughs> oh, God, you, I can't even cut. I'm shit. Right, so if anyone wants to, like, women-wise, wants to join a chat, yeah, just get in my inbox. And uh, we'll sort it out between us all. 
Um, doing something positive, not just saying. Thank you for doing this too, yeah. Sally. I bit off way more than I could chew last time when I really burnt myself out. You know, yeah, with... I bet. I bet you did. I mean, like, there's a you have to know. I di- you have to know your own like cut off point where you go right. Now I'm doing enough, and I can't do no more. So I'm gonna ask for help now. Do you know what I mean? Because it's not just one, there's so many of us. It's like, you know, it, it doesn't We can, we can just... all take a role yeah. on each and help people. Exactly, you know, there's so many of us. It's just between everyone, you know. It, it, you know, just be between everyone. Can we not show Shanita? I'll say the wrong thing. I had to piss out the company. Yeah, we can all pull together. Oh, like, yeah, yeah that's exactly, that's it. Yeah, man. It's like so I said, yeah, I you know, it. like the support group that um that we well we got I've got a women's group now that I think you're all in, and if you want to be in it, just let me know. And there's a um it's called a, well it's it's a hidden group, so you won't be able to find it anyway. It's a mental health and recovery group for addiction. Um. It's not just like for people in recovery. There is a couple of um, active sure. users in there that want to be in recovery but just need to take that step, um, which is fine because we all have to start somewhere, um, yeah, which I've started doing again yeah. because I had to pick. I, I was on the floor just recently and I've had to like pick myself back up again before I could stand up and start doing shit again, if that makes sense. Yeah. You've done really well lately. Uh, so yeah. you've done really well lately. Yeah, I feel well. But um, but yeah, you don't need to be done. Need to stop drugs or anything like that. Talk to us. Fuck that. You know what I mean? Yeah, that's <laughs> yeah, it. Yeah, you don't have to. Um, this that's the thing about Chip. He, he wants everyone to be total abstinent, and some people ain't down with that. Some people think, all right, all right, I've got an alcohol addiction, but I can smoke a bit of weed every now and then. There's nothing wrong with that. You know what I mean? And uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Sam Davis, my mic only connects for five seconds, lads. Not sure what's going on. I think it's streaming. <laughs> what browser are you using, Sam? What internet browser? He's unpublished it just in case it gets reported. Not going to lie, where right now? I've spoken out that name, but when I'll be full of abuse. Oh, n- how? Um, How said, not going to lie, worried now I've spoken out that my inbox will be full of abuse. Please, yeah, no, um, yeah, please. If they just it won't just block, block, yeah, them. block, yeah, yeah, and yeah, 100%. So, yeah. They can't do yeah. any harm to you, honestly. Yeah. Please don't worry. Honest to God, we're not here to like, make you worry or anything like that. Because we not, we not be making your name. Yeah. Your name will not be at the forefront of anything. It's always going to be me and Lee. It, so it, it, don't it, worry it, about that. Honestly, yeah, and it's honestly we, nothing to worry about, fuck's sake. Um, I, I've been at this fella since fucking Christmas. The geezer's a fucking cardboard cutout, honest to God, it really is. And, um, I'm not it from the end of March. Yeah, so, yeah, please, please try not to be I'm not, um, scared of any I don't know, people in the group or whatever. I'll try uh, Firefox. I think it's Chrome that you, is it Chrome you've got to connect to, to be on air? What is it they got? Yeah, Google Chrome. Well, Firefox Google Chrome. will work if no. Firefox mm-hmm. will work if Google Chrome doesn't. Uh, okay. Was it you I got to use Firefox City? Uh, Somebody couldn't no, get on. No, I, I signed in through Chrome, I think, through YouTube. Yeah, somebody couldn't get on one time and I got them to install Firefox and it worked fine. Um, Amanda just said, straight block, screenshot and send to us. Yeah. Seen. We are in the real world. Love to you all. Love to you. Oh, honey. Promise you, hon, we're here to support and protect. Claire, words can be harmful. Yeah, we're, do you know what, right? That's right. That's 100% right. The the amount of uh, uh, beatings, kickings, everything that, you know, uh, in person, personal, like with me, the that all the physical abuse doesn't come to nothing compared to the words that were said, because words stick. Words are harmful. 
words are worth sometimes. Vicious, isn't they? Words can be. Uh... Recovery is the new call. It makes me cringe at work. Oh, it makes me cringe as well. <laughs> oh, God, doesn't it? It, it? it just made me cringe then listening to it. And then, then when he thinks, when he thinks yeah. it's cool, he's a fucking idiot. Do you know what I mean? I'd say. Shimmy is the new toad. Yes, no poo. I'm going to have to make another song about him. I I was going to do a C, shan't we? Oh, my God, yeah. your song. Yeah. I can't even cope with you on your guitar yesterday. I was dying. Was that yesterday or today? Um, oh, that was yesterday. That was, I, fell, I fell asleep, I think. Um, uh, at oh, my God. I... That. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm rising stitches. Because they are not nice people. Remember that. Yeah, you're right. Um, I agree. I could be hit in the face by something being said that goes straight to my heart. Yeah. Oh, yeah, because you don't fucking forget. Do you know what I mean? Um, Well, if you're anything like me, uh, yeah, I don't, I don't, don't, well, I can't forget things sometimes. Um, Yeah. Lee, you're like trailer park boys. That's what Carrie just said. <laughs> said, uh, I fucking love oh, Shante. Does anyone watch trailer park boys? They've done a really funny one. No, I don't watch that. I can have go. Where's yeah. it too? I don't watch it. I've seen it. Um, um, my bubbles are my fucking bubbles. Bro- Bradley <laughs> Cooper was on it. He's um, he fucking deluded. Makes me feel sick to the stomach. Yeah. He's well doing. He does all of us, honey. He, does. hey, he doesn't realise He doesn't realise that the harder he pushes against me and you, Lee, and harder he pushes people to come over here, and we're straight talking yeah. sensible people. We're not nasty like him. Yeah. We don't go mm-hmm. off on the rails and be dickheads. We're sensible. And yeah. all them people are coming over, they're seeing the way he's getting on, and they're coming over here and seeing the way we get on. And they're saying, fuck, these are really nice people. Why is he doing this to them? Yeah, they maimed his mum because she sold drugs, but what about it? Maimed his mum. Fucking hell. Do you know what? So what is it? it, it like, uh, Hashtag. Like I said, I'll, I'll take the piss out of him. And at the end of the day, I'll, I'll take the piss out of him all day long because he's took the piss out of people for fucking years, isn't he? Hashtag. This is Amanda. Hashtag leaving the tribe. Is the new call? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm gonna use that now. I oh, leaving the tribe is the new call. Yeah. Oh, that's gonna be my. That's, that's gonna be my punchline. That's gonna be my tagline on my live from now on. Yeah. <laughs> leaving Shinny is the new call. Leaving the tribe is the new call. This new advert I just started. It still has the clip of himself strangling a woman yeah. on a bench. What? Right, right, who's standing with a fucking woman on the bench? Oh my god. His new Stop adverts are there is no consideration there for it. For it. Uh, <laughs> no, I wouldn't want to come across something like that and see it on the internet. I'd be thinking, Oh my god, like I hate seeing stuff like that, stuff like that. People would be coming across that on the internet, I've got nothing even to do with this and I'll be thinking, Oh my god. And we There's don't people... just make this up as we go along. Fact. <laughs> it is fact. But oh, see, yeah. the thing is, Shinny doesn't realise that when he's bringing people over here, he's being exposed. But this gets shared into the banter pages as well, so he's getting exposed to a very big audience. Oh, Jack, you're right. Jack Russell, name of a new group, page or group. Hashtag. Mm-hmm. And like yeah. you said, Stuart, uh, the more he fucks about, the more we get together, and he don't—he really don't realise this. Do you know what I mean? That's why we've been on stage. That's why we're on tonight. Because he's uh, pushing us he's together. A, he really is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He really is. He really is. Oh no! I, 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 I'm watching Netflix. Right? Oh, I wish I could uh, think. Oh, right, and the fucking trailer boy advert is coming. Where's my own camera? Oh, it's gone now. But anyway, yeah, they got the cartoon uh, advert of it. <laughs> Try your part, boys. Yeah, reporting uh, it as saying? violence and or need it is a waste of time. A new band, Shinny and all the. Mm. 
That's their last name around me. His mm-hmm. mouth's called Lorraine around me. Uh-huh. Hey, Peppa. <laughs> what was that? You just went to quiet there for a second? Or is nobody talking? No, it's, no we, we just read the comments at the same time. Oh, yeah, I'm uh, reading here as well. Mm-hmm. And I'm standing on. Play book from a few years ago. It's not a new ad he's made, even though he's claiming it is and costs thousands of bucks. Yeah. Because yeah, that one's good. Yeah. That, uh, does, that wasn't an ad that cost thousands. That there was him getting Maxine to follow him around with a kit with his phone. Yeah. 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 A hundred percent. He clipped it. He clipped it together. The fucking thing. What did he say? He paid for that. Yes. Yeah, he's trying to say it cost thousands. I don't often chat on lives, but that actually makes me feel sick. He eats like a pig and thinks he's God's gift. I yeah, can hate the dickhead. Yeah. What's happened? Yeah. What life? Are yeah. you okay, Tracy? He, he, he's not out all the time. He's he's not out all the time. One of his reason, adverts was alcohol. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, it was. It was, uh, it was uh, uh, alcohol and gin. Thank you. Where's my other, my, you, my one tongue, my mouth? Can I just give it to you? No, you gave me my last one at 8 o'clock. My one now is 10 o'clock. Thank you. Thank you. I'm just going to mute now whilst to take my medication. No problem. I oh my god! Before I mute, what was that I just seen? Hang on. Aliens anonymous. Hi. <laughs> Do we have any <laughs> aliens here? <laughs> no, they're all like in Mark Chapman's back garden. No, I'm an alien. I'm not like a predator. I'm fucking. I've been sent. Fucking, yeah. Uh, what's it? I've been sent down to stop Chippy before he fucking. <laughs> before he does say fucking stupid. Fucking hell. It's the heave. Yeah, it's disgusting. Haha, uh-huh, I just did a really big. Really sad. Wait a minute. What's that? Mm hmm. Right, I'm actually going to mute now and take my meds because otherwise I'm going to forget and then I'm going to find them tomorrow and think, shit, I really should have took them. <laughs> Get them into your city. You yeah. need your meds. They've all Wait gone to Cyprus looking for their spaceship. He invests nothing into that page. He's not even got a decent mic. All you hear is the wind on most lives. The show is run on mobile phones and costs nothing to produce. Yeah. Which is very true. Right, I am muted now. Yeah, no, right, no. Oh, hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. <laughs> <laughs> you know the sad part? You know the sad part? He probably is a good one. His brother. I don't believe he was ever a good man. Yeah, yeah, you're right, Han. Like, you don't... Yeah. Right, Han. I'm, hell, I'm going to message you after this, but I'm going to take my meds now. He was a horrible man. Yeah. He was manipulating women into the bed since he was the age of 10. Should I say that girls on the town from his age of 10? And it would say to me that any girl over the age of consent would not have pondered that 10-year-old, which means that yeah. he's a rapist. Yeah. 
Hell, that's disgusting. That is disgusting. He, they, 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 he, he does that. He blocks you and then he slags you off. And no one deserves to be slagged off on a main, well, main stream, but live stream. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, it's very good. Only, only Chippy. Only Chippy. Come on, let's not forget that. I can't contradict myself in one sentence, can I? <laughs> All right. What I was going to say, um, this is another thing, Stuart, right? If I was doing lives every day, yeah, right, and uh, I had an audience and all this bollocks, do you know the, one of the first things that I'd like get? Like, uh, you'd, you'd get a, a decent microphone and a decent camera and, uh, and all that shit, wouldn't you? Yeah, but he still uses his phone. Yeah, 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 yeah. For all the money he was making, you'd think he would have rigged his house up a studio. And a little, a little tiny studio, I was saying. Yeah, you'd think so. They, they must have been living beyond his, his means or something. He must have been. He must have been on a lot of debt over drugs or something. Yeah. He stayed in that flat for a while, didn't he? Got old chitty tits. <laughs> I'm glad I've still got that old picture. <laughs> Back. I, I know people from Salford and they're going to do there's someone's going to do a knock for me and I'm going to ask another few people to find out who owns them flats yeah all you have to do is knock a neighbour's door and say here mate who do you rent from apparently everyone uh, from Salford just thinks he's a fucking dickhead anyway yeah, he's, always been, he's, he's, he's always been a dickhead as well uh, this um, yeah, sure. Look at you on that traffic warden. Oh, chippy choppy tits, chippy choppy tits. We all know you've had chips. No, what, Lee? Lee, that don't sound the same now without your guitar behind it. You have to, you have to play your guitar as well, because it's not the same no more. I know. I've got to be in the mood. Oh no, I've got to be in the mood and all. Wow. Funny. Funny, funny. I can't just be funny and just, I don't know, it's weird. <laughs> That's just one of them things, Lee. You just play can't help being funny. That's okay, Aye. Maxine. Do you know, we've taken your meds, Maxine. What, you know, what, um, like, I, I dissociate and I forget to take my meds. I, I wouldn't take them if it weren't from my partner. Um, but what he does is he sets an alarm. Every couple, because I take meds every couple of hours. See? So he sets them every couple of hours so that I never miss my meds. So if you set an alarm, if you keep forgetting to take the meds, set an alarm and then you won't forget. Unless you're like me, I'd probably set an alarm and still forget. When I. Mm-hmm. Uh, if I had his address, I would order everything on credit. <gasps> oh my God. The voice <laughs> A voice clip for you. you can have I'm an empath, me. Nikki, one. you are an empath. We're all empaths. That poor wee baby is going to be a did. She certainly did. So now we well, like, well, yeah, yeah, what's all this about um, fucking uh, even Chippy's selling his socks even like uh, what happened to his socks? And why is he only sending them for email or something like that? Send the five cents off. No, the fella said that is um, that Wayne had contacted Warner Brothers a long, long time ago <clears throat> about him using the Guy Fox logo on his socks. And that Warner mm-hmm. Brothers must have gotten in touch with him over them. No. <laughs> Who's that Sam the fucking dude, mate? Sam Davis. Who's that? Who's that that been? Who is posting the socks out? That's a good question. Who has a business partner? He does. He sits there all day fucking putting putting boxes together and and putting dozy fucking cards in them as well. (laughs) He has nobody to ship them out. Of Maxine's, mm, yeah. So can't people. 
a Sully Kelton's that? trying to get out of the handmade pollock. Fucking, fucking book, I do. I want some of the like his books are going missing or something. I bet it's the only copy he's got. You know Hell I mean? said um, his business partner left. What do you mean, hun? He's pushed everyone away. All right. He's pushed everyone away from him, hasn't he? Uh, since Christmas, every, all his team, everyone who's working with him and all that, he's literally pushed away from him because he's such a lovely person. I'm um, on a grubber. Yeah, Julie, honestly, set an alarm, Han, and then set a reminder every 10 minutes until you take them. Like re a repeat, repeat reminder every 10 minutes until you take your meds. Because then you can't miss them, hon. Yeah, you need to you take your see. meds. You don't want to be uh, getting sick. Yeah. It's a routine. I leave my by the bed. Um, sure, did you yeah. see at one stage Shinny was trying to tell people not to take medication and that yeah. they should go on CBD? Yeah. And I said, I said to him, like, look, I said, do you not realize? I said to this doctor on there who's got his. CBD business, so of course he's going to be trying to shift the CBD because he's got his own bloody business. I look around okay. and I said, because he's like telling them all about the CBD. I said, look, all I said is what I got blocked for, because I said that if he is selling this CBD, he has to give the right information on it. If you are taking CBD and you have yeah. heart problems or taking any kind of medication for heart any kind of medication for epilepsy, any kind of medications for brain like brain, brain injuries and yeah. st such like that. Well, you cannot take that, CBD you? because it makes you yeah. fucking ill. Well, My dad had two heart attacks. I should know. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. And I, yeah, I said to him, like, yeah. you're not telling people the, like, he's advising all these things for people, but you're, I said to him, you're not telling people the effect that could have on them if they stop doing these things you're telling them to do. If you're telling them to do these things, make sure they bloody well know what's going to happen if they do stop doing them. Because if you just all of a sudden stop taking every med that the doctors give you, the doctors give you medication for a reason, people. You know, like they don't just give them to you for shits and giggles. He is, he is dangerous because he just said, uh, and I was thinking then, right, um, they're all shinny shows, right, they're, they're, they're all exactly the fucking same, isn't they? Every single time I see that, that, that doctor, he, that Dr. Nick, he's, he's, I don't know, he just does exactly the same shit. Exactly the same yeah. shit. But, um, yeah, like CBD it. becomes the main drug in your body. Um, it fucks up warfarin and all that. Um, it can be really dangerous when you're taking yeah. other medication. Like it really can. Um, and yeah, he ain't even got a clue what it is. I asked him if, uh, if he knew what a tricone was. He didn't know, know what a tricone was. Fucking idiot. Harry, well, really. I was on sertraline. And then, to be honest, sertraline made me suicidal. And I had to stop taking them. So now really? I take Satilafram. And Satilafram? Satila? I can't say it. But anyway, they're really, I take them and they work for me. Um, did I? But yeah, I did used to. Just trying to perm search for me. Right, how did it all get mixed up? I'm very sick. Stu, do you know who his partner was then? They said his partner wanted out of the sock business. I can't remember who it was. I don't even know who he had one. Yeah, he did. There's people here. No, there's people in the groups. No, I'll be able to find out. Feel like. Wait, why you oh, keep saying things? Yeah. Yeah. someone who, who drinks three liters of vodka a night to, yeah, yeah, no, it wasn't three liters of vodka. It was three bottles of wine or thing. But yeah, no, he did. He yeah, told, just told him to stop. How fucking ridiculous! Look, look, look right, even if you ain't a fucking addict and you've been drinking uh, all day, you're gonna feel shit, ain't ya? Do you know? <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Yeah. What sort of advice is that? It's fucking ridiculous. But um, yeah, it could have been very dangerous. Could have, that that lady could have been lying, and she she could have been drinking eight bottles of fucking wine uh, a night. Do you know what I mean, or something? Um, yeah, yeah, definitely dangerous. Very dangerous advice. Very dangerous. DTs are not fun at all. They're, they're, well, they're literally uh, lethal. Oh, that's nice of you, Maxine. I didn't want to say, same CD. I didn't want to say that there. Oh, sorry. I just uh, I just blurt it out as it is. <laughs> 
Um, mm-hmm. Where was it to? Sorry. Um, I think it was Laura, if I'm right. I think it was. She said that she sets like her Alexa. Alexa, I think it was. It was Alexa uh, to set her alarm. Yeah, it was Laura. Oh, let me get her a drink here. She does her Alexa for her meds. Alexa, stop. Um, <laughs> Maxine, where's Maxine to come This is free to listen to. And I can relate with so many people here, even though I don't chat much. You know the one. Thank you all. Oh, that's nice. That's cool. Yeah, that's Maxine cool. That's Simpson. Cool. I'm going to message you today, actually, Maxine. Oh, Maxine, she, she's lovely. She's lovely. Maxine. Hey, Babs. Hey, Charlotte. Vanilla. I can't even say that What you're on. Ben, uh, I can't say <laughs> You ran off quicker than you could take your socks off. <laughs> yeah, yeah which is that? Oh, no, I could have it. Huh? Uh, Brandon. Oh, like Brandon. I don't even know who's that, mate. Uh, Sam Davis. Ben Jones. Receptors from IPS. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, uh, got cut down there. Just, yeah. Uh, uh, uh. Sam Davis, benzos hit different receptors from opiates. Got to cut down very slowly. Yeah, benzos can be one of the most dangerous things coming off of. Mm. Yeah, well, uh, what Chippy was saying, he was saying that benzos are opiates. The fact, for... Benzos are dangerous. Benzos aren't opiates. I'm an idiot. One thing, right. as a alcoholic, you can never say is okay recovered. No, of course you can't. Definitely not. No, you know, that. you're an alcoholic. You're always an alcoholic. You're just in recovery. And I, the same as yeah. me, I'm a drug addict and I'm, I'm always going to be in recovery. And I'm, I've accepted that. Um, it's not going to go it away. Life. I'm not going to get 10 years down the line and <laughs> not be an addict no more. You know, I'll just be in recovery. Yeah, no, that's uh, right. I'm, <laughs> I'm, all, I'm always an alcoholic. I learned that there, that I will never be recovered, that I always have to. Be dry. I can't yeah. take the chance of hitting the drink again and am yeah. not liking it and finding myself in the same position, situation that I was before. And it's not it happening. I'm not so a fast, yeah. it? It Julie, so um, you don't sound thick. Yeah, um, and I un- like understand, you know, there's loads of people here that understand, you know, not sleeping well, and you can't remember if you took your pills. I leave it as two blood pressure tablets. I don't, don't double up. No, don't double up, Han. That's dangerous to double up on them. Um, yeah, don't double up. Just maybe set an alarm with a reminder, you know, a reminder ten minutes or every fifteen minutes after that alarm's gone off, so yeah, you know that you're done taking done it, that. you know. But don't double up, plan. Yeah, put your alarm on snooze if you don't intend to take them right away. Or maybe you could... Did you say you on... I'll leave that to you. So where, where the lady's not sleeping well, um, she's getting confused. If, if she can't remember yeah. if I'm taking her. But she's scared not to double up or not. Um, yeah, which is uh, the right thing to do. Um, or maybe set your pills out for the day and all that, and then you know how many you've got, and then how many you've took. And, yeah, and a dosset uh, box. Yeah. You could get a dosset yeah. box from your um, local chemist, and then you put yeah. the medication you need for the week, and you can even ask your uh, chemist if they'll dosset box your medication for you. So when they give you your medication, it's all in day-to-day pot what you when you need it i did not know that wow well, didn't know that yeah you can yeah. get it dosset boxed or if, if they right. won't dosset box because sometimes they don't dosset box it for you you can buy right. a dosset box only like a pound or two a couple read, of pound in yeah. the pharmacies read what carl said there carl i've spoke to carl before in dms he, way back at the start when i first started getting involved with all he this he isn't and... recovered He's just what swapped one addiction for another. His problem was not an addiction to drugs or alcohol. 
he's addicted to attention. Yeah, attention. that's yeah, so true. Well, he's been talking you to couldn't be more right. You know, he's been talking to himself for the past four years, looking in, the, looking in that camp, in that fucking camera. Do you know what I mean? Like, oh, it's unbelievable, really. And the, me and Stuart were saying, why the like, if, if if we was doing or something, you'd get a big camera and a fucking mic and all that, wouldn't you? But he's been doing it through that phone, looking at himself for four years. I get the chemist to do my med box weekly so I can keep track of my meds. Yeah, it's the best way, you know. Amanda, my meds yeah. come in a blister pack. Ah. So um, when those stars were coming in, he was like a gambler at he the Grand mental, National. Yeah. He was, yeah. Yeah, he was fucking mental. <laughs> yeah. He has an addictive personality. Anything that makes him feel good or gives a buzz, he will do over. You will overdo. Yeah, is, I have an person. addictive personality and need to be put into check sometimes. Right, I'm not what? an addict. What are you doing I'll things call that it. fucking make you happy then? Well, this is what I've been But I found you guys and you're all amazing. Oh, that's nice. I, that's I think I've he done. wants to... I think he went to AA meetings and NA meetings and copied everybody's... Sure, them. Julie, I think that's what I need now because really struggling. Yeah, Julie, honestly, please do do that. One second, one second, my little lad, one second. Oh, I need to put this in the charger. Fucking never thought of that. Didn't realize. Sorry about that. Same as my eight percent shit. Oh, I'm so tired. My little lad's got he's got special needs and he he doesn't sleep. He sleeps like two hours every night, and um, it's bloody weak. And um, sorry, where was I? Yeah, he takes everybody's shares. He's fake. Yeah, I, I agree. I do think that's what he's done. Um, I think he stole someone else's story too. I always said that from the start. Nothing adds up. You know, nothing adds up. He can't answer. Right. He can't answer he questions. Can't. People throw at him. No. No. He, he's been <laughs> he's been uh, sharing for four years now, and yeah, they make their story like they're liking his story so his mum is dead and all that. They make it be weird. Call your pharmacy and ask them for help. Yeah, quite frankly, Chippy isn't fundamentally a very nice person, to be honest. No, that's why. Right. Really, Same really to me. Isn't. I heard your calls on his show. That was a question. Yeah, he really isn't a very nice person. He's, very, he's an horrible, horrible, horrible person, man. I'm telling you. Unless you're you know what? Little clip. Sorry, my bad. Hell, honestly, if you get any crap, block them. Don't even reply. Don't even give yeah, them a time yeah, of day. I... Seriously, just block, okay, Han? Just block. And you should be fuck really, you know, you just said that, you know, about standing up. You should be really proud of yourself for coming on here and saying, do you know what? This happened. Anyone that comes and does that and says, "Do you know what this happened?" But don't We're engage all them whatsoever. Proud of you. All don't proud engage of you. them. Do not engage. Just hit block. Yeah. Don't don't look at your message requests or anything like that. Just yeah, yeah just, you just have your own yeah. for your own mental yeah. health sake. Like Definitely. if you just hit block, it's like um, what is that old saying? Uh, out of sight, out of mind. So if you hit block, they won't yeah. be thinking about you. And then there's some go away anyway. Chippy slagged off the NHS. The NHS works so damn, works so damn well hard. Yeah, he yeah. said, you'll be waiting weeks for help. I received help from him at the house in a day. I called, yeah, I did home within 48 hours. Um, Yeah, I did within 48 hours. And I was, well, yeah, I had a care plan. And I've had the care plan since. 
That's good. No, that's good. Uh, um, but even drug addiction is is still only roughly about nine days. So, you know what I mean? If you, if you can't wait nine days for a script, then you ain't really ready to go on a script. You know? Al Stratton. All you okay. will get is concern, babe, from this side. The fuck is that? All we care change? about, all we care about, is making sure that nobody gets hurt. Sam Davis, Nothing. what's a rumor been up to me? Joe Rimmer has been. Do you want to say still, really? Joe Rimmer has been messaging ladies from the tribe that were in looking support. There was one lady, I'm not going to say her name, but she has posted in the group herself. Um, she just uh, lost her baby and she was in distress. And as soon as she joined the tribe, Joe Rimmer got into her inbox, got her phone number off her, and started offering to go round her house. And it's absolutely disgusting. The woman was in an awful state when she found us. And lucky she did find us. And that there's why I'm kind of glad we had Sadie as well. Sadie has talked to her and a few other yeah. people that have looked support from us. And I'm going to stay around and I'm going to keep doing my lives to try and help people. Yeah, I am. Who have been victimized by him. I'm going to try as much. So, my health, so. My health has been picked up greatly this past while I was very sick there I didn't know where I was going to pull through at one stage I felt that bad um, I ended up in the hospital see, a few times and he kept calling my name and I'm going to try the people, uh, people that are in my life were worried for me and yeah. he kept goading at me but because of that, and because of the stories I've heard this past two days, I'm going to stay there. I hear I'm going to keep doing lives. If I have to make more pages to the same name, I'll do it. Yeah. You know what, Carl, you're right. Let's cut to the truth. He saw a vulnerable woman and tried to exploit her grief and situation for his own ends. He did, because um, he did that to the one lady, which is, do you know what, she's such a nice lady as well. And then there's another oh, lady. Done, She's only a young girl. Though. I'm not saying how old she is, but she wow. is a young girl. And uh, three times, like, you know, four times, five times, six times. Like, hmm. She's uh he was messaging her and she's um she's got she's she's got autism. She's very vulnerable. Um she's in a bad way, she lives alone, he's in her inbox, he got I can't even explain what I've seen. You know, and I asked her, could I, because I thought, how do I safeguard this girl? Because I knew she was in a bad way. And I said, well, can I, can I speak to your mum? I thought, would you mind if I speak to your mum? Because I'm very concerned about you. And she said, no, no, like, it is okay. And I thought, right, well, and I rang her and I spoke to her and she was very nice, you know. And she's just gone to, she's gone to pick her up. So she's gone to pick her up. So she's left now and she's calling the police um, and making the police aware of the situation because it, it, it is abuse, What what's happened. I ain't safe at all. And we're not even just talking about the last few days. We're talking about over a period of time. Mm. So, uh, so, yeah, it's not very nice. I, what I've done, so I put everything into a Google Drive for her. And sent it back to her. Um, she's gone to bed. Oh, Tracy. Good night, you lovely people. My Blackberry Crumble is calling me then time to wind, unwind. Take care. Mm. My inbox. Mm. Always open to anyone that needs to chat, scream, cry. My ears are open. Oh, that's nice. Night, Han. Have a lovely evening. Mm -hmm. I love Blackberry for moments. Okay. Good message. Yeah. Okay. Honey. Is, but how many uh, have been too scared to? Then I blame them, mate. Uh, makes you think, doesn't it, guys? No, it does make you think. Dresses shouldn't be put out. No, they shouldn't be. Um, yeah, was, and now she's worried that because she had to give her a dress and everything to join. 
she's now worried that they've got that they've got her address, and she, it's just awful. Wow, that's terrible. What do you have to give me a fucking address? What do you want me address for, the cunts? Alison, I know you won't be a reader or anything. Okay, what? what? Oh, I do. Yes, no Especially with the shit they pulled oh, off li- uh, Lee. Oh no, who do they oh, think they I'm are anyway? Oh, seriously, who the fuck do they think they are? They're, 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 they're fucking hell, man. Not, not one of them's got a degree between them, do you know what I mean? They ain't got a clue about what they're fucking talking about. And um, trying to take people's addresses, fucking credit card details, trying to fucking give them rules, trying to tell them what to do, trying to tell them they're, they're, who the fuck these people think they are. They're, they're just chippy, you're a cunt, mate. Daniel. Pisses me off. I may not be the brightest person, but I am blessed with my common sense. I can see straight through Chippy and the followers. A lot of people yeah, can, can, yeah. Do you know what, Maxine Han? I don't it's not that they're deluded as fuck, the followers. No. The people that are in the tribe are brainwashed, honey. And the, you know, there's such a big difference between deluded and brainwashed. Does that make sense, Han? Like, he's made them feel a certain way for them to be so um, blinded to it all. Does, do you know what I mean? They're just faithful, aren't they? Faithful followers. And, 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 uh, I don't know. They're, they're, they're I always said it's, it's kind of like, I don't know what the name for it is when people get sucked in and then they feel they like can't leave. Or the fall yeah, for the abuser, uh, Stockholm oh. Syndrome. That's it, Stockholm yeah, Syndrome. Fucking yeah. hell. Yeah, Stockholm Syndrome. It's yeah, Chip, you're them. robbing me, but I love you. No, I mean, that's right. And you yeah, the police are up. aware, hon. Did, so did you contact the police about this one? Pardon, hon, no, the yeah. girl's mum has. They've contacted oh, the police yeah. about the behaviour in the tribe? Uh, yeah, yeah, the girl's mum has, yeah. yeah. Good. Yeah. Because I called her and I explained absolutely everything that's been going on, and I said, like, look, you know, like, um, and I said about you know the groups. I said her mum can join the groups, you know, like the tribe and that. I said like she can see for herself everything, what you know. Um, and after this, we've obviously, because it's been over a period of it. It's been ages. Like this chat's long, a long, long chat. Um. So yeah, so yeah, the police. Uh, she, uh, the mum, has gone to the police. That's the only way something's going to get done about this is if the law step in to safeguard vulnerable people. Yeah. yeah. But like that guy, Lee yeah, Brady, yeah. getting kicked out. I know he's not one of the nice people out there. I've come across him. Having a girl that was vulnerable on his life with her, she was naked on his life. What? That Lee Brady one, the one that got kicked out of the tribe. He had a, had a young girl run about naked on his life instead of cutting it off when she was drunk. Oh my God. That and she obviously sad. had pages. Uh, she obviously had problems. And yeah, I had a go with him over that him. there. <laughs> yeah. But, what, what I'll do is I'll, I'll pop some. <laughs> Support groups up in the like page if he wants me to, but I, I'd um. I think what I'll, I need. I'll stay away you. from the inbox if that makes sense. <laughs> yeah. Uh. You got me to die, sir, uh, I think Decca is getting annoyed with people from here going over to him. <laughs> oh God. Well, he it's turned like... around and well, he did turn around and say that. Did you hear what Decca said last night? The. He tried to he tried to say that the people that that picture was took for um and people were trying to he tried to say that we said we were going to rape his daughter, Shinny's daughter. What? What? Decca last night he went on he went on live last night and he said that that's why I went off because I was fuming I was going to do or say something that I regretted. Decca come on yeah. last night and he turned around and said that um. Shinny, that we were threatening to rape Shinny's daughter. Did you not hear about um, that? No, no, no. Then, oh, no, then. no, we aren't brainwashed. We are looking for help. Sadly, we fell on that page. Yeah, that's what I mean, hon. Like, you know, like people fell on that page 
they've That's been so taken important. in by him and now like until like when you're out of it you see through it and you've seen through it because you said didn't you that you'd questioned them you know um but some of them can't they can't see any of the bad that's going on. Do you know what I mean? And I'm yes. sorry, yeah. I'm, I'm yeah. going to talk to you after anyway, Hal, but I can't even believe what you've just said to do. That who the hell even thinks, like, that That scenario wouldn't even run through my mind. Like, why is yeah. that scenario running through Decker's head? Like, what the fuck? He said last yeah. night that people from here we're going to rape Shani's child. He said we were going to rape Shani's child. He's a disgusting excuse for a human being him oh too. God. That's what I said. He'd know all about raping children, wouldn't he? Bastard. How dare he? Well, he doesn't yeah. like it when it's said about him, so let's see how he likes it now. That's because Shinny embellishes the truth. Yeah. Oh I, my I God, was... Charlotte, are you serious? Odeka from Edinburgh is in my inbox too. Oh, mm -hmm. oh, honey. That's what Charlotte Cook said. There now. Yeah. Charlotte, just block them, hon. Don't engage them. Do not engage them. Look, there's plenty of us. There's plenty of us to engage them and keep their attention. Don't gather their focus on... me to go on a train. You've been through enough, Pat. Yeah, honestly, Char, please. Just please. press the block button. Don't try and get involved because... Um, I can't there's believe plenty that. Of us, there's plenty of us here to deal with stuff like that. There. Don't you Don't you be getting yourself involved. Just hit the block button because we don't want you to suffer yeah. anymore. You've been through hell, Pat. You wanted her to go on a train. After her telling him what happened, I'm not sure, but she just said he wanted me to go on a train. Just hit the block button, sweetheart. Lock him, lock him. Just, just yeah, lock him screenshot him it all, though, honey. Screenshot it all. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to ring you in the morning yeah. anyway, shall I? Right? I was speaking to Charlotte yesterday. I helped her unsubscribe yeah. from the oh, trade wow. and she's lovely. Yeah, she's beautiful, yes. and she had a train call over yesterday. Lovely, really lovely nice. woman. Really, really nice yeah. person. I am. Well, well done, Han. What is it with these sick bastards that can't get it in? Why can they not even be friends with women instead of always having to try and get into them? Yeah. It's upsetting, isn't it? It is upsetting. Women are not objects. And, and it's that's the reason the why, ben, why Ben? Ben? It's a reason why men get given such a bad name. People like that. Because people like that, you know, and unfortunately there's loads of them, <laughs> you know, but there is loads of good guys out there. There really is, you know, like I never, ever thought I would say that sentence. <laughs> that there's I'm, good I'm, guys I'm, in the world, but there, there actually yeah. is, believe it or not. <laughs> like I'm not in, like I, I, I'm not interested in women, and I'm loving having all the female friends here. I'm not interested in relationships, and not interested in dating. See, since I stopped dating, my life wow. has been far better. Of loads of female friends, um, we get on really well. And I don't know, I don't know what everyone threw me years ago that I couldn't just be friends. You know, it's far better. What's that? Hashtag just for Geraldine. Just, no, Geraldine, Geraldine, yeah. She's always the one Amanda's message to you, Charlotte Han. Dude. You're right, Stu, regarding Decker, <laughs> the beast, Teggy, after what he done to that young wee girl. Then poor Geraldine, hashtag justice for Geraldine. I'm not sure what that's about. I spoke to that girl, he sexually abused her, um, mentally abused her in a relationship. Um, yeah. He used to get her to dress up as a schoolgirl and all, um, call him daddy and stuff. He's a sicker. Oh, my God. This one, man, the new people calling out fucking other people. Oh, well. Can I just say to you how you've never been crazy, honey? And we were all a bit crazy, but you've never been like, 
it's no, Jackie. Fantastic. It's it's someone. It's another person from the tribe has done it. Um, they're not right. Doing this to all these people, they're they're just yeah. uh, that's two out of the tribe. Jackie, so you're right. right. Oh my fucking god, has that wrong in the being been messaged? That girl to go on a train, yeah. That yeah, it was Decca that messaged her to go on a train. He wanted to meet. He wanted her to. Was it Decca? It was Decca. Yeah. Fuck you now. Yeah, it was Decca. So Decker. they're all at it. Yeah, they're all at it. It was Decca. And it weird, right? Out of first tribe, you then you couldn't message anyone. That was that was a really staunch rule. That was it was really weird. You couldn't message anyone only because I bet they was all fucking messaging. They fucking oh, man, you know, there's like, no healthy like, direction oh, given to these tribe members. You become admin, yeah. I it's, oh, it's, it's unreal. The admins and now now. She's a Joey Rimmer. Now she's a Decca. They're all out of it. They're all scumbags. Yeah. And Joey Rimmer thinks he's a counselor. He's going to talk in prison. He's a fucking idiot. He's a fucking idiot. Yeah, he's messaging tribe members. Yeah, honey. Katie. If he's talking in prison, I think he gets raped in a prison. He can't. Well, no, I don't really mean that, but I'll blah, blah, if you know what I mean. Jeez, like. they are all on the vulnerable girls. Absolute scum. Yeah. Success pit. They are. Yeah, it's unreal. Yeah. I believe that. Yeah. That woman's just lost her baby. That's unreal. I'm fucking angry now, even more. It, it, it's, Brandon. It's, 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 right, then she's got autism as well, the poor girl. Autism. I you get I mean? a bad vibe from the Viking. He speaks very suggestively oh. to female newcomers to the tribe. Brandon, do you know what, right? No more Please, I can't even get started on the Viking because I just then I won't shut up and I really talk on that. What do you, what do you think of him? So because I, mean, I only uh, met him for a little while and he seemed all right to me. At first. What do I think talk. of the Viking? Yeah, I don't want to say on it because maybe, maybe I, I could be quite. Know. I don't really want to say on it. I could be accused of later things, but personally. In the most oh. politest way, I would not want to be on my own with the guy, and that's the truth. Right. Geraldine right. was raped when she was younger, and when Dick was having sex with her, he used to ask her, her, her heart is to Oh my god, oh. Sadie oh. teaches you the breathing technique, yeah. I'll read your message after Kim, Han. Yeah, I don't mind doing that if Stu wants to. What's that? Um, it's a it's a breathing technique of like um, it really a breathing technique. It really helps with like stressful situations. Um, it just helps loads of things really. It it helps me balance myself back out when I'm not feeling too steady. I I tried breathing techniques and all. Oh, sorry. I tried breathing techniques and all before. The 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 where I I I can I know them all. Um, I know how to get out of anxiety as well. I used to yeah. suffer really bad. I I had I had over a year of cognitive behavioral therapy, and you learn to teach you a lot of stuff, distraction techniques and all, how to distract yourself. I've learned that nipping myself up for a lot of Gips that's really sore distracts me from panic. He made a video to explain why he finished it and posted it in a tribe. Um, he did make a video and post it in a tribe, but he actually done it over a live. It actually happened over a live when he actually done that to the to the girl to the girl. Um, when he finished it with that girl, it was done on a live video on the actual page. It was awful. Who's that? Hi, Dan. Who's that? Oh, I was thinking. Um, the Viking. Yeah, the Viking, when he finished with that, with the girl that he was seeing in the tribe, he done it over a live video. He, done it on, he, said, he said something at the end of the live, um, and it indicated to her... Uh, 
that he was that he was finished with her, basically. That's not good. No. They're they're yeah, devastating. Emotional abusers. A oh, lot of them shouldn't she be. She was a month into recovery. Yeah, she was. Yeah. And, oh, be, uh, sorry. Yeah, he's upset in and out. Sorry, I'm just muting a minute because I'm just going to get some donuts and eat some donuts. Um, yeah. I just want them, I don't want them feeling, I don't want them feeling left out or. <laughs> he's just he's felt that he's been left out since yesterday the wee man since I got the new cat and it's not right I love him the bits he's brilliant hopefully they get on hopefully they, uh, they get on they yeah they will in a while he's just a bit nervous around her he, he hasn't been around any other animals since he no. came here and I have him a long while and he's just he settled in so well he did and he's just, I, I don't want him getting jealous over either. You know, I want him to be able to get on work. So I'm giving him plenty of reassurance can, and photos today. Can I, do animals get jealous? I don't know, don't I? Yeah, yeah, Lisa, you're right, Han. <laughs> you're right. She did relapse shortly after. Very sad. How many dodgy stories? is like the gays who commit yeah, suicide. After, do you know what I mean? That's well, heartbreaking, that story. It really is. It really is. It shouldn't it really even is. be a story. No, no, it shouldn't. It shouldn't even be built. I'm All right, we mom. Unfortunately, yeah, I don't know, you baby. Right, I'm eating. I'm going to eat some donuts. All right, huh? All the actions come back from this one. What's that, man? I don't know. It's just there's more and more horror stories coming out of that place every day. Yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah. It's disgusting, isn't it? Really, it is disgusting. I knew it was um, dodgy, but fuck me. It's, well, if it's as dodgy as. Uh, if any other girls start coming out and saying, yeah, we've been in the box, we've been in the box, we've been in the box and all that, then fuck me. That's a few people now have come out and said that, Lee. I thought it's not just <coughs> that girl today. It wasn't any shock to me, Lee, as I've heard it before, that the, the tribe was just one big knocking shot where all the guys were trying to get off the girl, all the girls constantly. Like, it's... 16 year old mentality, oh. it's child mentality. And you want, yeah, what? Uh, Sam says it's been a real oh, can, can of worms today, can't wait for tomorrow. <laughs> uh, he won't be on tomorrow, he won't be there. Shit's himself. Oh, uh, well, now that the police have been contacted about the behavior, and that's right, but it's gonna. Not gonna go down well for them. Depends what it what depends what it is really, don't it? Uh, it could be logged or it could well I don't know. But people that got shouldn't be in charge of people that aren't well is exactly. making me Exactly, this is what I mean. Who the fuck do I think they are? Who the fuck do I think who these people think they are? It it it's it it, 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 it it fucking boggles me, it really does boggle me. Me too. I just I can't I can't I, I can't get my head around it. Then what are they meant to do in it? They'll be doing. What's Whitney doing? Then? What's Whitney doing in tribes? So, hello, how are you? Oh, lovely. And all this fucking bullshit. Um, what's Shinny do? He don't have to do fuck all. So what's the tribe? The tribe's just a group, a group for the people. It's not a lot. It's a group for the fucking selective men. <sighs> They need to stop what they're doing. That's ridiculous. That the stories in there and it's just making me sick. Because thinking about it, and I shouldn't think like this. It's, it's the same men who's been in there since the last fucking drive. 
It's the same same geezers, the same men. Yeah, of course it is. And they're all the same carry on. Every time yeah. a woman comes in, yeah. all the men jump in their inbox and try and get off of them. And these are vulnerable people we're dealing with. Them people shouldn't be let allowed near anyone that has problems that <coughs> it shouldn't be allowed near them. I just want to know, guy, what is this? The money side of it, why the fucking hell does he even need the money? I just don't, I really don't get it. He, why doesn't Maxine, why doesn't Maxine give him a job? Yeah, exactly, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because he, well, do you know what? He, he, he's mostly master manipulated fucking earth. If, if, if he can take her, if he can take her from his fucking best mate, then, yeah. He's master manipulated her. Is that was and his then, best mate, then, that boyfriend? Yeah, and then he's telling them that he's not allowed to see his children and that he's seeing them in court over the phone when the child's sitting there. Like, what right has he to tell a man that he can't see his child and he'd see him in court? What is right has he, he to tell anyone? Is that yeah. what he said to him? Yeah, and he laughed at him. Oh my god. Oh, fucking well wanker. The old chip was talking about being a real man and all that. That's why he, that's why he, 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 he talks to himself every day. That's why he looks at himself every day. Because he's literally talking to him, fuck himself. He literally talks to himself. Tells himself how much of a better man he's got to be in all this fucking shit. I don't know, but I don't um, know what shit Maxine's been phone his head full of, like. He came on one day yeah. and said that he went and done the shopping. He's a real man. <laughs> Normal men go and do the shopping, not real men. What a dick. <laughs> what has she been telling him? Yes, you're. Oh, come on, do the man. shopping with me. Come on, do the shopping with me, Shinny. You're a real man. Normal men do shopping, dickhead, not real men. Imagine seeing him in the fucking hospital saying you can't. I'd put loads of beer in his fucking trolley. <laughs> oh, damn. I'd well, have shit on the floor or something. Fuck no. The thing is, mind you know, apparently I've heard the Maxine's just as bad as him. I've heard. I'm not 100% sure, but I've heard. But talking to her the other day, I don't even want to fucking talk to her for fuck's sake. But anyway, um, she was trying to sound quite reasonable, and I thought, well, yeah, but it sounds like she don't know half of this shit. She's popper. You know what? She's right? and, 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 so showing yeah, five yeah, yeah. sadies. All, all, all this secretive stuff as well with him. And these lives might make a bit of sense now. I don't know. Yeah, Jean, I'll inbox you, Han. I don't know what. I don't know why you're showing five of me. Showing Where's, five Sadies. <laughs> I can only see one Sadie here. Um, no, I'm like when Jean was searching for my profile. Um, oh, remember you? Uh, no, you deleted your profile by accident one time, didn't you? Yep. <laughs> oh, um yeah, I have got a couple of profiles. And I swap between them sometimes as well. Um, how he's a real man, son sit the fuck down. I gave birth to four kids and all of them I brought up. Does that make me a real man? I think that's supposed to say. With large chippy tits. Hmm. Um, there was a one just now about him. I think it was from Carl. Him being removed from the page from where he lives. Carl is um from Salford. He thinks he's famous. His own council council removed him from their famous Salford Dean. However, you say that page. Bloody hell. Is that someone from Salford who knows him? Yeah. Yeah, Carl knows him. 
Oh god, there was another funny comment as well. That was it, Sam Davis. Carl, she only what was the shop in because she's fourteen months pregnant? <laughs> Carl, Carl, what was the story about Maxine and the B and B's in Salford? You know that one, don't you, Carl? About uh, Maxine when she ran the B and B's and why they were shut, or is that Carrie? Was Carl still there? Carl was here a minute ago. Where's Carl? There he is. There, he's still here. Carl, you um. You should know about that there when Maxine had the BMBs in Salford and they were shut down and what they were shut down for. Yeah, she has no new music, she? Uh, she does know she's the lowest person ever. Well, I don't think so. I don't think so. Uh, yeah, apparently she didn't like him at first. Oh, there's a meme of Mr. I have a load of memes here. To go up, um, my main supplier is on a roll today, and they're hilarious. It was a drug date, the the main supplier done the drug date and granny one. <laughs> Gee, if it helps, my profile's got a bearded dragon as a profile picture. B and B and E's. That was exactly why it was shut. B and B and E's. And C. B and B and C. Not to be confused with the BBC. <laughs> Sam, you're a fucking cracker. Sam's funny as fuck. Do you ever see some of the stuff he comes out, will he? Sam Davis. Oh, he's brutal. Absolutely brutal. He goes for the throat every fucking time. Take no prisoners. <clears throat> She's out having a wee sniff around now. Okay, but pays for fans. He can't even read their language. But we, as the tribe, are in Sing and Delusional. Don't ever, ever change your translate because I changed my translate to understand the writing and um, the comments. Sorry. comments sorry. And it changed my whole phone tricking language. I had to. I had to ask for help, and then even then I couldn't see what I was bloody typing, so it's all I've mixed up. And Sarah helped me in the end. Chat <coughs> screen noise. record to show me how. Oh, you know, Sadie was like, "Yeah, yeah, it was me." Yeah, chat to screen record how from like how to get it undone because I couldn't find the settings because I couldn't read the freaking writing. <laughs> But yeah. What's the girl next door about? Oh yeah, she used to be a porn star. Didn't like the council B and B for homeless. Did it change your whole Facebook? Yeah, it changed my whole Facebook. Not even changed my whole Facebook, but it changed the fucking like everything off of Facebook as well. Sorry, Sadie. I, my message was because he's paid for followers, wasn't it? Oh, I didn't take it offensively, Han. I didn't take it offensively at all, Han. I just, it was because I, what, what I'd done, Han, is, you know, like he's paid for his followers and he can't understand them. Nobody can. So what I've done to try and fucking understand them was put like turn on like the translate so I could read the bloody comments of the people that are writing their like comments that is like in different language. And uh, I changed. I clicked on a comment. It was obviously a Polish man because it changed my like my text to Polish, but it didn't just change my settings on Facebook to Polish. To pay, like it, it actually changed my. I turned my phone on. I thought, "Hey, that don't say Facebook." And in my whole settings, in my entire phone was changed. My contacts. I couldn't see the name of people who were writing comments to me. Ugh. Found his car and how much it was. 
Sadie, I don't think you can translate while slow unless you access the comment section of the video. It should a translate button underneath the squiggly right. I'm not even yet. Yeah, it did say translate under the squiggly writing, but I'm never pressing that button again. It took me ages to sort it out. So he got his car. His car was 57,000 quid. There's where the recovery tribe's money's going from, going to. What's that, sorry, huh? Check the pinned comment. Check out the red on the new motor. Second hand advertised in UK for 57 quid. Beginning of July, fuck. There's where the tribe's money's going to. Oh my god. But he doesn't take a wage. Yeah, no, he doesn't take a wage. He's the only one that takes a wage. Yeah. Oh, oh my god, me? she's starting to trust me. Now I feel a fool. Why do you feel a fool, Han? Sadie, she's starting to trust what me, the new cat. Ah. Uh, well, anyway, fuck's sake. What the fuck are you doing, Carl? I love that. Um, like when the your animals start trusting you, like we um rescue reptiles, and uh, mm. it's beautiful when you like start taming them and stuff. We've yeah, kept a couple of the ones we've rescued. <clears throat> she wasn't she wasn't vicious or anything. She was just afraid. She scraped the life yeah. out of me yesterday. She's my arm looks like I've got into a fight with Freddy Krueger. Where did you get her from? Um, I got her in Gumtree. I seen her on you had to have her. I wanted to get uh, him a wee friend, and I had to get some something that was a wee bit younger than him, so he wouldn't be afraid. But he is afraid of her, and she's tiny. Yeah. <laughs> but she's sitting. She's lying at my head now. She's lying beside me, looking at me. Damn, babe, he's sucked so many in. And when we aren't yeah, in a good girl. place, we just want anything to stop feeling like that. Don't feel silly or anything like that. You're away from that now, and we all here for support. Yeah, yeah, you're right, Carrie, huh? We're we're all a big family here, and you know something? It was a girl that used to be involved in the Sunny stuff, Louise Smule. She was absolutely lovely. One of the nicest people I've ever met, too, and she said that if anything, Shinny has done one good thing out of all this, and he has brought a group of lovely people together and helped them make friends, make friends with each other. Yeah. Um, so. Jean, I did just get your message, Han. I, it came through to me. Sadie, what reptiles do you have? I have three geckos. Oh, I love geckos. I've got one gecko. I've got two tortoises. <laughs> I got <laughs> two bearded dragons, a, a Chinese water dragon, and a bosk. And they're my babies. Oh, and I got a snake as well. No, you forgot Gretchen then. Got a snake as well. I love reptiles. Whatever happened to Lucinda? Yeah, I've not seen Lucinda in a while. What? Sorry, Katie. Sorry, Sadie. Sorry. What was that, Han? What did you say there? Sorry. When was that? There now. I must look. What about my animals? Oh, no, no. I heard you send you the gecko and all. Oh, um. Oh, just a Muslim and importantly. I can't remember. Oh, no. Just I said, it. I said, I uh, have um, some. Uh, Andy said, whatever happened to Lucinda? And I said, oh, I haven't seen Lucinda around for a while. Amazing. I want a beardy so much. That's a lovely collection of reptiles. On my life, I got one leopard gecko, an adult crusty, and a little ten week old crusty. Oh, I love crusties, they're so cute. Oh, I'm gonna have to, I'll send you, I'm gonna have to send you a couple of pictures of mine, they're beautiful. I think she left over a hashtag Votergate. What's that?
Oh. Oh, uh, I've got my eyes. I get dry eyes on the. Uh, got fucking. Uh, got dry eyes and they got stingy. Yeah, I like that, Scott. That'd be great. What's he doing? I'm sorry, I can't see. Uh, I said um, I'll have to send him some pictures of my reptiles. And um, he said, yeah, I'll send some too. They are my world. Yeah, honestly, you wouldn't believe, like, uh, my, like, rescuing reptiles um, has very, it's helped me so much over the last seven years. Um, well, eight years this year. Um, it's, it's coming up to it since I um since I left, but um you know they my reptiles have helped me no end um cope be alive because you know you gotta take care of them every single day you know like feed them water them make sure they're like like make sure like all the little mucks and messes are out there tanks and vibs. And you could spend hours just like faffing around with your reptiles, like my bearded dragon Eki. Got Eki and Kush. And Eki just chills and Kush just was just sits on you all day just chilling out. Serial scammer. Maxine looked well pissed. Oh, with him sat in the new car. Harry, I understand. Always here if you want to chat. I also don't leave my house. Hi, I Karen. I understand that. Hi, Sue. How are you? I'm all right, you? Uh, doing well. We're just having a nice chilled evening here. And Who's we've that? Learned some... We're just... That's Karen. Hey, uh... Hi, Sadie. How are you, love? I'm good, you? Yeah, I'm not too bad, thank you. What have I missed? What's happening? Do you want to tell her, Sadie? Um, I don't mind. I, do, I don't mind. Up to you, hon. Oh, you work a lot. Tell her. I chat too much. All right, so, um, so tonight there has been, um, well, obviously we know about the lady that, um, a lady sadly was going through some grief at the moment, and uh, Joe from the tribe um, jumped into her inbox and yeah. sort of started taking advantage of her, um, you know, through her loss, um, through the vulnerability of what she's going through at the moment. Really? And yeah. Um, and um, so I've been speaking to a couple of the people from the tribe, uh, four left, two, well, one now is still just hang. One was, there's two, two was hanging around, but um, mm -hmm. one of the people who was hanging around tonight um, did actually, I already knew this and was taking steps to help this person. But uh, before she opened up tonight to people, um, which she came on and done. Uh, as a young girl, a lovely young girl. She's mm -hmm. autism, very vulnerable. Um, oh. Yeah, so he um, jumped into her inbox ages ago. And he's supposed to be going around there on the weekend. Um, and she's petrified that if she blocks him, he'll turn up anyway. And she's petrified that they've got her address. And anyway, I spoke to her mum. Um, oh, is this the Joey Rimmer or somebody? Yeah. Is it him? Yeah. I, I heard something. I wasn't sure. God. Yeah. And um, it's just madness. Like, why is the men over there taking advantage of the people who are joining the tribe for help? When he mess, if he messages them, he should be messaging them support groups and support places, 
and NHS support and stuff like that. You shouldn't be messaging them like, oh, well, I'm here for you. I don't mind talking with you. I don't mind you phoning me. I'll come and see you yeah. on Saturday, love. Do you know what I mean? There's no need for it. No, it's not appropriate for, t- for him to go to a house, not at all. No. Well, I don't think it I'm... is anyway. No, it's not. And this, this poor, like, these two women, and it's like, why uh, have they been taken advantage of like this? Okay. This one young lady, I don't know whether she's going to allow to put screenshots out there, and I doubt she probably can at the minute because she's actually gone, mm-hmm. her mum's actually going to the police about it all. Um, right. But it, it, well, it, it is vile. It's, uh, it's vile, what I've read. It's not nice. They shouldn't be allowed around vulnerable people. They can't. But I don't want to see that with her, but he sounds like he seems a bit of a groomer or a predator to me. Yeah. Who's on at the moment? More. Which Karen's on? Me, Karen Pike. Pardon? Karen Piper. Oh, Karen Piper. Okay, hon. I just wondered yeah. who it was because when you said Karen and I was listening to accent and I thought, hang on, this isn't the Karen that I know. <laughs> but, <laughs> too many of them. <laughs> but yeah, the thing is, you know, is that like you can't, and there's, there's this other lady as well, which came through the other day. She came onto mm-hmm. the live and she said that um she, she she's a lovely woman. She, um, in the tribe, she's come away um, because all these, you know, um, he's paid for all these uh, new viewers to make yeah. build up his numbers. Yeah, you see the um, comments what they put on. It's hilarious. Yeah, yeah, he's build. Um, he's paid for all these um foreigner viewers to like, make it look like he's got a massive amount of numbers. Well, these men bounced in into this woman's inbox and pounded her so hard by keep ringing her and ringing her and ringing her that after five years of being clean and sober, she started drinking the vodka. Oh, she fell off oh. after five years because she was just so pushed by these men mm. that she fell off and she started drinking. Oh. And, you know, I... She's back in meetings now and stuff, and I sent her like all the links for free meetings on Zooms and stuff like that. And obviously, she can um, get in contact with places in her area and that. But five and years, and they hounded her. Yeah. Stuff's got in. It's because he doesn't, it, like, he doesn't know what he, how to run a page, he doesn't know how to look after anybody because all he looks after is number one. He's not bothered. Uh, yeah, hundred percent in that one. All he does care about is the money, and I've said that all the time. I've said it a hundred million times. And mm-hmm. oh, do you know what, Helen? You're right. You're very right. And do you know what? I bet so many people feel like that. I will say, I get fed up of being called vulnerable. We aren't. We are a little bit lost. We seek help as we want to be better. Do you know what? You're right. Um, you know, some of us, you know, um. We, some of us aren't, and we are. Some of us are a bit lost and need help. But there are some that do join that are very vulnerable. Like, for instance, um, these two women I, I'm talking about now. Like, um, you know, they they are they they are very vulnerable, and they join seeking help. And I some like aren't. You know, when I joined, I was vulnerable, and I guess that's why I say it. I don't mean to like. Um, I don't mean to like. Uh, Make it sound like everybody's vulnerable. I don't mean to make it sound like that. Man. I just mean no, no. That. I, I get what you're saying. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Well, it's like if if some one of us like cause I've got another account that sometimes comment, but my comments to him is that thick. They don't come with crosses that I'm kicking off with him. I just like yeah. like today I've I've got one of my dogs in my dog's account right, and I'm going, oh, do you need a visa to work in Cyprus for stuff that he doesn't. Do you know what I mean? He just ignores it, but I just put it out there, stuff like that. But if we, one of us went to Shinny with what you've just said and said, look, this is what's happening to people in your group, what, what would his reaction be? Oh Nothing. He'd be like, no, it's not. Don't be so stupid. We wouldn't have that yeah. here. 
we'd know yeah. if that was happening. Yeah, because you've got you've got a, a Whitney Shitley head of security, yeah. You? you don't get past yeah. there, do they? That's you know it. Yeah. I mean? it's, it's not really cares where if if if, if he really did say like right, I'll investigate, I'll look into it. He wouldn't. He'd just say, Oh, it's just you trolls causing bother. It's just you trying to cause trouble. That's his answer for everything. To deflect yeah. it from him. But um, you know, how you're right, you know, I like I say I, I say that a lot and like me maybe I shouldn't say that a lot, you know, like because well I don't I don't wanna upset anyone by saying saying that, do you know what I mean? Yeah. Because that's the last Not thing I'd want to do, is upset somebody. Yeah, for... I don't know if you remember um, who I am, but you did invite me to your group. Yeah, I did, yeah. Yeah, as soon as she remember. said who yeah. you was, I was like, yeah, I know who you are. <laughs> <laughs> I just didn't recognise the voice. That was the first time I've actually come on stream now, to be honest. Oh, fair I haven't play. I haven't, I've, I've, I've wanted to, but I've been too shy, but I've had a couple of glasses of wine, so that's probably why yeah. I've done it tonight. How do you feel about being on? I feel all right now that I've done it. Oh, brilliant. I wasn't sure I was following the link. I was like, I'd never done it before. I thought, oh, I've done it right. And then I thought, oh, I've got a heavy camera. Right? What do I do next? <laughs> but, yeah, no, I feel all right with it. I'm very honest, Sadie. I was in a terrible place, but I understand what you're saying. But every time someone speaks about the tribe, it's, we are vulnerable. We are simple, we are stupid, we hand over money because we know no better. It's not the case. And I certainly didn't mean to offend you, Sadie. I've got a gob and I'll speak my mind. So don't be sorry, never be sorry. I'd rather you sit there and say it as it is than hold it back and think, oh God, she's pissing me off. Do you know what I mean? I'd rather you say, oh, yeah. like, I'd rather you not like, do you know what I mean? I'd rather just, well, I like because, that. Because I like straight people. Well, because well, I've that sounded bad. Tonight. I don't really know what I'm doing, but I'm not seeing any comments, and I don't know what I need to do. Yeah. You can see the comments. Do you see along the bottom there, it says chat? Yeah, do I click on that? Yeah, you click on that, and then at the top it'll say comments. You click that. Oh, right. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. You got it. Good. Yeah, I got it. Yeah, people yeah, are saying. You. It's just turned into a nice relaxing chat. This is my yeah. life. My life today has been pretty calm, considering what people have been saying about me. That's it. Who mm -hmm. is the lovely lady that's new on the stream? Oh, me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm Karen. <laughs> First time yeah. I've done it. But I've been watching them for months and months. But... I've, I've seen Karen in the comments and all there in the groups, and you've been on my lives before. Yeah, I have, Stu. I have, yeah. yeah I know Karen. Hi, Karen. Karen's lovely. Oh, thank really you. nice of you, Hal. It's lovely to have you on, Karen, so it is. Well, I hope I'm to brave it to do it again. Thank you. <laughs> but I love courage. it when new people come on. I remember yeah. my first time on a stream yard, I was scared shitless. Yeah, mm -hmm. me too. My first live, <laughs> I got on with um, it was Lee. I went on with my first live. Back in our stream yard, the accident, and then he went live on Facebook, and I went on that there, and we sat and chatted for hours. And it was at night time too, not like Lee to be on at night. No, oh, hi Ria, hi Lisa. Who's Sam Davis? Oh, Sam is funny. Have you never seen Sam in the groups? No, where you? Uh, he's asking where you ever in the tribe. Dish the dirt. I, no, I was. I've never been in the tribe. I've watched the shows, but I've never like paid to be in the tribe. If that's what you mean, Sam. <laughs> oh. I think there's enough dirt for one day. We need to leave something for tomorrow. <laughs> that's like. That's like uh, the boy that wants to open all his presents on Christmas Eve. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's not over Christmas morning, Sam. <laughs> oh, the wee girl is starting. <laughs> I got another cat, Karen. Oh, uh, have you? Yeah, I got a wee black kitten or, um, yesterday, and she's she only starting to get great now. 
202. Uh, That's how many was in there? Yesterday. 202 this morning. It's What's up that? one. Yeah, up one from yesterday. Right. So is, is the kitten, is it a boy or girl? The oh, kitten, yeah. the new one's a girl and the other one's a boy, but he's afraid of her and he's doing some serious growling. Really? Yeah, oh. but he wouldn't he wouldn't do anything. He's a gentle he's gentle as a lamb, like you know. Yeah. I I I had him lying on my bird chest today, growling at her like you know, I wouldn't be afraid of him turning a hole in my chest or anything. He's gentle as a wee lamb. He's just mm. he's just he's just he's just afraid of her and he doesn't know what way to take her. It's oh, not you, went up ten people it. say where that hundred quid that lady did no, it gave him. The thing is is it's not going up as well. Um and uh, was it Amanda said still two hundred and two in the tribe. So cute. Um, and then um, Carrie said it's not one up ten people. So where's that hundred quid that the lady donated to give ten memberships or whatsoever they called it? Do you know what? Right, I reckon. I don't know how shop work has been done. I think the reason why it's not going up is because everybody, the people that he's trying to shout that out to. Is he us watching, or yeah. people are watching and they're thinking, oh, "I'm not joining that." But I'm not paying my money. I'm in free groups because a lot of people probably have gone off and found free groups now. Well, yeah, they, they can get better help in free groups than what they're paying through him. What does he yeah. give them? Nothing. Just about him, 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 him. That's all it's about. What's that? Where's the live with Shirley and Kane? Well, I see that when um, Claire went on Shitty's live today, I didn't realise that Kay had done one with him, has she? Someone's put in the comments, where's the live with Shitty and Kay? Is that not Shitty and Claire? Oh, he's growling again. Is he? <laughs> Oh, sorry, um, I, was, I was preoccupied there. Sorry, I went off then. Um, sorry, I was just saying, someone's put in the comments, where's the live with Shitty and Kay? And I just said, well, I didn't realise there was one with Shitty and Kay. I did see one with Claire with them earlier today. I don't know if it's that one they mean. Oh, my God. Did you see that one, Stu? When well, Claire well. went on. When oh, yeah. Was only, it, caught the, only taught, caught the tail end of Claire. There was someone come in here and said all she done was shout over Shinny and didn't give him a chance to speak. I suppose all Shinny does is smirk and mock you when you give him a chance to speak. Well, yeah, but it was, like, really good because um, she was asking him. And she's, like, he was, like, you could see his brain was taking over. She was, like, asking him stuff, like, about, well, you're saying you're getting this one, you're doing that, so how are you paying for advertisement? Do you pay such a body a wage? Do you pay such a body a wage? It was really good, like, she proper grilled grill them. Yeah, I, I'm going to actually, I'm going to have to watch it back because he deleted his two lives from the day. Oh, did he? Oh, right, I thought he might. Yes, I only caught the tail end of Karen, and I was raging that it did. So it's just somebody came in and said, Karen's on, and I went on and started playing the live, but he cut her off at that stage, then uh, Claire came back here. Yeah, well, um, I think she said she was going to put it on YouTube, because we were, because we were actually talking about it. She it has, it's, it's, it's on yeah. uh, Stream Lives Yards, uh, Stream Yard Lives Matters uh, YouTube. Yeah, because we thought that he would delete it, because that's his normal trait, isn't it? What are you growling for, mister? What are you growling for? But did you see, the, did you hear, I was laughing, like, because after that, Whitney went on with him, with Shinny, and she was saying that Shinny deserved an award and that, and how she was going to nominate him for a Pride Britain Award. I was like, are you for real? Is she on Pride drugs? Of... My Pride oh. of Britain Award? So I say really? she probably isn't drug sheet, but then again, she she's just a sex addict. That's all she's addicted to, getting her hold. Well, yeah. Because she said it herself, like on numerous occasions, 
And why she keeps saying it in the comments, do you ever notice every time Shinny asks, what's your addiction? And fucking Whitney always shouts up, I'm a sex addict and I'm a, and I've OCD. Can I yeah, just say, I that, yeah. I'm not sure if any of you may remember Sherry. I do, honey. She took my story and told it as her own. She was, as me, very active. She realised you can do peer-to-peer free. And when she made her own site, after she... bigging her up so much, put her down so much, as he did to me on the live, it's horrible. Yeah, it is horrible, Han. It really is, because nobody should be... Whose story did Sherry steal? Mine. She... Uh, she... Sorry to say this, everybody, but she... Oh, Stu, I'll just message you because it's like, uh, I don't want to, because there's no trigger warning on it, and it's it's not a very nice part of my story that it, it is not a very nice part of my story, so I will message you. I didn't know it was your story, Sadie. Part of it, yeah. I, I knew she stole someone's story, like, but I didn't know it was yours, Pat. Yeah, it was me. You're a wee soldier, do you know that? Well, it's part of it, anyway. I know Sherry, she, Sherry's recovery. She keeps inviting people to. She tried her hardest to get stars. She want. She, her Shinny was her model, and she went off and no. made her own. She made she her own her recovery own page. page. She does lives on oh. her own page now. Oh, yes. Yeah. I'm so sorry. sorry. Oh, hon, don't be sorry. She started off in um, her and Louie went off and made a group of her own, but Louie outed her saying that all she, she was interested was in stars and subscriptions. She turned right. Louie she turned Louie against me unfairly. Like and then obviously when everything happened with Sherry, me and Louie started talking again. Um and obviously then it all come to light that obviously Sherry Oh, it's just the whole lot of them are just wrong. Yeah, I, just, I can't even talk about it because it just proper riled me. The whole lot of them, none of them people should be near anybody in recovery or with mental health problems, and that's just my opinion. Yeah. But I was vulnerable at the, like that at one stage, and I would have been easy led and sucked into people. But I quit drinking. I using. I only smoke. I smoke weed now, but I sat there because it helps me a lot from the pain. Um, mm-hmm. Well, there was a bit uh, alive with Key and Lee said to Maxine, if you knew how to things he sends and says, you wouldn't be sticking up for him. And before she got a chance yeah, yeah. to say anything, Ginny grabbed the phone back to him. Oh, yeah, I did. I see that bit with Lee. I think what that was, it was when Lee actually got on Ginny's no. live about how, how he um, made lives about while Lee was on holiday. And then accused him of a message in Maxine, but Maxine actually came out and was sitting at the table. And Shinny had said, Oh, do you want to speak to Maxine? And Lee was like, I don't know if I'm 100% exactly just what was, how it was said this way. But he said to me, like, No, I don't really want to speak to Maxine. But in a way, he did. And he was, Lee was saying, I, I wasn't messaging you, Maxine, and I wasn't. I think that's what Carrie's referring to. And then he tried to say it was me. He tried to say it came from two mad parties um, two minutes after Maxine had said that it was Bill and Ben. Do you know what, Andy, you're right. She played up with Mama Wolf and started making wax melts and crayons. Last time I heard, yeah, she's making wax melts and crayons and selling jewellery and apparently as part of their recovery package. Um, And how, don't worry, hon, you, you, do, you weren't to know. Do you know what I mean? You weren't to know. People didn't even know it was me until I just said, well, no, it was me, but it was me that she'd done it to. But it's not just me that she's done it to you now, since it has come to light that she has took parts of other people's story and made it into her own. So it's not just me she's done it to. There are other people too, which is really upsetting. Okay. She takes parts of people's stories and adds it together. Oh, that's crazy. crazy. Horrible, you know, why, why would you do that? To, you know, like, well, you don't do that if you're right in the head, do you? You don't. Mama Wolf commented that she was buying a new car and going to Bell Valley Valley for three weeks on the back of her wax melt profit. 
<laughs> yes, Terry, that's right. <laughs> Lee was really respectful to Maxine, but the flaw in there is that story about the text message. The actual text message that Maxine received said, James, now everybody who knows Lee and I do, and Lee is a sound geezer, he, he speaks the truth, right? He never refers to Shinny as James. He calls him Chicken Tits, not oh James. Yeah. I call him James, but, he admitted, but others may be in condescending. He admitted yeah, but, but, his mum selling drugs, his drugs was a lie. So what else yeah, was did, a lie then out of his story? Discussed him. But, well, the thing is, he said that much lies about his mum because there's a thing on YouTube where mm. he's actually saying that his mum had died. And she yeah. hasn't. Oh, yeah. yeah. Did you, you know see that the Did you see the clip I put up? One of her, uh, one of her friends, um, found the lie where he said that his mother sells drugs. What do you hear? You know, that's what I played it earlier. Yeah, I heard. It. Apparently, yeah. he admitted that he, he lied about his mum selling drugs. So if he can lie about his mum and then he's swearing on his kids' lives, you just think, how low are you going to go? Yeah. No, this bit here, I'm going to play it for you. I'm just waiting for the oh, future. Okay. Here. From my youth, he would buy a few bags of whiz every day. Things of people selling gear for me, including my mum, believe it or not. I'd given it one of my regular clients from my youth, who would buy a few bags of whiz every day. You hear that? Yeah. Have you heard the rename for the rename for his book? What it's going to be called? He's renaming his book. No, I'm, t- I'm taking I'm, I'm taking the piss, but I'm re- I'm renaming his book. It's Shay's little book of big lies. Mm-hmm. It's it's not even a part of a book. It's like a pamphlet. Have you seen it? Yeah, I mean, I've been writing, and I've wrote five journals. I'm on my sixth journal now. Like, oh my god, like, and there's big journals as well. So I don't know how he's just wrote. And he's way older than me as well, you know, and I don't know how he's mm-hmm. just done 200 and some odd pages. I've written well over. I've written well over that. I mean, well I would have thought that. to consist for a book, surely it must have to consist of a certain amount of pages to be classed as a book. 200 yeah. odd pages for me isn't a book. That's just my personal opinion, but. Yeah, I don't think it is either. Oh, and did you hear about that as well? Here's another one of his scams, apparently, before the book was going to be launched, like when he was going about it all earlier on, about three, maybe, maybe about six months ago. He was doing this thing where you could pre order the book. Yeah, and I heard he, about he, that. He, he There's loads of people have paid. Book. Yeah, they paid about 50 quid, I think it was, for a signed book, which isn't mm-hmm. going to happen until next year, but they paid for it, and people have paid yeah, for the stuff. Because you know when he brought out the shitty socks, and I think he, he, he got steps one till six, or maybe one till eight, I'm not 100%. And then he was going to bring the remember because it was meant to be the 12 steps of recovery socks. So people yeah. paid for the other lot of, of the steps of the socks, and, and obviously never got them because he never made them. Oh, I don't know. Mm-hmm. Ah, uh, exactly, that's three pages in a chapter. There's a chapter consists of three pages because books that I've read, it's a lot more than that in a chapter usually. Yeah, about bloody 20 or 30 pages in a chapter. What is that mean? He's an idiot. Like, you know, I don't care what, what any of us tribe think. He's a great idiot. Like, oh, but don't forget, he's a real man. Oh, real men do the shopping, all right. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's, that's what real men do, isn't it? Uh, real men do the shopping. Real men don't take money off vulnerable people, full stop. No, because a real, real man would have a conscience and wouldn't do that and exploit people and use them for their own benefit. True. He's just, he's a scumbag. I just don't know how the hell Maxi is with yeah, him. Yeah, you're right, Babs. Have you seen Bab's comment? Which one? Faces he was pulling during that was sick. What? Which one was that? 
Oh, the trailer, the trailer for his uh, supposed movie. Oh, he's got a movie coming out, as you know. Oh, he had all along. He was making a movie, and there's no movie. That's what I said. Um, he said he was going to make a documentary at me. I said to him on his life, I said, all right, there's going to be a documentary. Like, there's a lot, like there's going to be a yeah. book on a movie. What's it going to be called? The Actual Truth. <laughs> oh, that was no truth, but that on the face. Is that a thing? Or he doesn't know the meaning of that, does he really? He killed a cockroach today and said that's what real men do to look after his kids, after their kids, what the fuck? I've got a massive colony of cockroaches in my house, all the reptiles, and my partner don't kill them. But he's the biggest cockroach, just leeching off people and feeding on them. I can't even, like, understand that. He killed a cockroach today. I said that. That's what I do. To look after uh, Yeah, I think that's what that was. Do you mean an actual life. cockroach? Yeah, because what had happened was, Sadie, he was doing his live, and we heard, a kid, we heard a kid like cry, and it was it was Maximus, I think that's the little um, Maxine's son. So he, he he left the live and went to see to him, and he was like, "Oh yeah, that's what real men do." I heard him cry, so I went to see him. He scared a cockroach, so I killed it. So I thought, well, oh, and he went, "Is he I thought, "Well, no, because that's what you do, looking after every child, regardless who they are." Yeah, I don't kill any that come in here either. I just pick them up and put them outside. I don't ever, you know. Yeah, but he's just a horrible I got a massive person. colony of cockroaches. They're like huge as well. I bet you used to torture animals as a child. I bet you did. He strikes me as the sort of boy that would kill kill cats and stuff. Oh, yeah, that's his family just showed his bullshit, yeah. He certainly does. Yeah, I the got little the cat over snapping my ear. She keeps moving away every time I open oh, my mouth. Okay. Every time I'm quiet, the cat comes over and sniffs my ear. Then I talk and she backs off. <laughs> it's so funny. I mean, what little oh, boy yeah. wants to see somebody kill a cockroach? If I killed a, like, mm-hmm. a cockroach or anything in front of my little boy, he'd be devastated. Mm-hmm. Oh, yes, yeah, Lisa. Be... Lisa's put, he took that 10 seconds out of his day, real man. Yes. Yeah, he's a real man. He takes money off of those who are not able to pay, not able to afford it, to have peer support. It makes me so mad. And then he goes on and he gets on the way he does in front of these people that aren't well. Yeah, absolutely. He's teaching them how to be dicks and pricks. And then he has Charm and Carol coming over and. That's Kyle cheating and trying to say the making up lies about me, hoping Shimmy she's going to be his downfall, and I hope he is. They're telling them lies about me. Yeah, but you know what, Stu, right? He talks that much crap that he forgets what he says, right? He on the live today. You were doing you were doing a live. What the fuck? What? We bet Batman. Ow. Never. Here. Oh, we bitch. Oh, just so timid. I'm just afraid of everything. Oh. God, this is hard. You bite my four. Oh. I've just I've got her in my stomach now. She's gone down. I think she was just uh, she was smelling my arm, and she must have smelled. So I must smell like food. Oh. Have you any animals yourself? Yeah, I've got a Shih Tzu. Shih Tzus are lovely. Very yappy, but, you know, whenever someone's coming to the door. Oh, or... yeah, definitely. But he's a little shit at times as well, though, but I love him. <laughs> Very demanding. Call he's called Louis. Louis. 
Yeah. <laughs> I call I call him my boy cat monkey. I haven't named her yet. Oh, have you not? No, I'm waiting to see what her personality is like. I might call her Nepper yeah. after that. Hi. <laughs> well, I named him Louis after my Irish roots because I'm actually Irish. Um, I was born in Dublin and lived there till I was 10. And then we moved to Manchester, but I've been in Newcastle for about 21 years now. I'm surprised the accent stayed with you. You think I still got a bit like? Oh, I can't, I couldn't nail your accent. I can't exactly work out. Well, my friends call me a licorice all sorts, especially when I've had a drink. It comes out Irish, Mancunian and Geordie. <laughs> Oh, you're, you sound more Jordy to me. You think? <laughs> yeah, but that's because right, I'm, 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 I'm from here. I'm going to pop and go into the comments. Okay, All sorry. Right, sweetheart. Well, I'm dozing off here. Yeah. <laughs> I'm right, not belong on myself. I'm, All right, then. I'll speak I've to you done, later. I've done about six, seven years. Oh, don't bite me anymore. No. Oh, Sam, I'm, I'm, I don't know if you know where I'm, Tala, in Dublin. That's where I live. <laughs> what are you biting me for? Sorry, you have a mix. <laughs> I don't know why she's trying to bite my arm or what it smells like. <laughs> is we bitch? What time is it anyway? There's 11.41. I'm going to get some sleep here. I've, oh, yeah. stream. I've done about six, seven, eight hours of stream yards today. This is Have you been, <laughs> yeah, but yes, we've all been brilliant. Like we've all stuck it out, and we've all sat here, and we've all talked over issues. But the way I've worked it out is that the longer I stay on stream, you are the more people I can save from the tribe. Yeah. Oh, and, thanks, Lisa. Nice to meet you too. Lovely meeting you, Karen, here. Look, like, uh, I remembered you from the start. I seen your name when you come on, but I didn't want to take the banner off to show your name unless you didn't want to show it. No, no, that's fine, but I've got out to hide. I'm real, that's, so fine. <laughs> that's brilliant. Look, guys, we'll take another chunk out of them this morning. I have a couple of memes to post here, and then I'm going to sleep. Oh, definitely sweet. Oh, thanks, Carrie. Well, uh, I'll, now I've done it now, I will definitely come on another stream with you again soon. <laughs> All right. Speak to you later. Bye, Bye guys. Bye. Bye. Bye, everyone. Bye. Bye.